What's up, y'all? It's TTC, aka the Thunder Conductor, and we back for another YouTube video and Twitch stream. If you're on YouTube, make sure you like, subscribe, and ring the bell. And if you're on Twitch, make sure you follow and ring the bell. We do this twice a week on YouTube and once a week on Twitch. So let's get straight into it. I got a question for y'all. What is your favorite Modern Horizons 3 pre-release card? We got things like Chthonian Nightmare that's gonna combo with Dockside. Like, what the fuck is based off a banned card? What? We also have the new MDFCs, where I'm not gonna lie. I love utility lands and everything that's about not running a basic land. And the fact that you all are giving me untapped MDFCs, y'all are fucked up. I, I'm, I've already wasn't running basic lands, but now it's, it's settled. I'm never running basic lands at this point. You're gonna have to blood moon effect against me. And we also have the Nadu, which is crazy. I really love Nadu. I played against it in one game and I re immediately realized that everyone who is raving on this card is by far, it is very much understood. It's a very powerful commander. But I, myself, TTC, have my own favorite Modern Horizon 3 card. And it's not Nadu, it's Satya Aether Flux Genius, a Jeskai commander that's 3 5, a legendary creature, human artifact, artificer. That I like to say, this is Rionia's spoiled cousin this is the cousin that got the extra colors but has a little more restrictions he's blinged out gives us energy that and he says whenever a uh, satya aetherflux genius attacks create a tapped and attacking token that's a copy of up to one other target non-secret non-creature token you control you get two energy at the beginning of your next end step sacrifice that token unless you pay an amount of energy equal to its mana value so what you can do then is just chill and sit back and be like all right well I'm gonna make copies of my Esper Sentinel, Esper Sentinel, of my Archivist of Agama, my Fairy Mastermind. I'm even gonna go, gonna go infinite in the command zone with Lightning Runner and Roaming Throne. This crazy, this deck is crazy, and of course, we're not leaving home without Underworld Breach. This deck also does a plethora of Bleach, Breach combos with Brain Freeze, Jessica's Wheel, Wheel of Fortune, Windfall, Smothering Type, does all the Breach shenanigans. We're even on Brass's Tunnel Grinder, if you, uh, if you couldn't imagine even that. But we're doing all these amazing things centered around this amazing Jeskai Commander. And so all I have to say left before we get to we, and before we get into this amazing gameplay is that if you're looking for more ways to support the channel, there are a plethora. Starting off with our Thunder Conductor uh, proxies. These are my amazing way to increase access to this amazing format that we call CEDH. And if you all are looking to get access to the Modern Horizon 3 cards before they get released soon, go on and check the link in the bio. You get high grade, right? Look, I show you right here. These are card, card stock proxies that I love and stamp our Thunder Conductor premium logo on to get certified that these are the quality that you're looking for. No, no more are we gonna be doing paper on top of your cards, card stock proxies that get the job done and honestly get an amazing art. You know, look at that quality, oh, it's sexy. <laughs> Next, we have our Thunder Conductor merch. It's soft, clean, gets the job done. Check it out, link in the bio. And we also have our Thunder Conductor Patreon. I want to take a moment to say shout out to our mono red tier patrons Scott Mitchell, Wavy Hashira, Nathan Stridham, The Praetor, and Sir Trekkie. Y'all are awesome and you keep the lights on in, in ways you couldn't even imagine. And if you want to join them and get things like shout outs in their stream, exclusive QAs, and deck submissions to have your chance to have your deck done on right on the stream check out the link of the bio but even if that's not good go ahead and check out the discourse it's free to enter we talk about brewing we jam out games and we have a great time we also last but not least if you say i don't want the proxies the uh the merch or the patreon see i just want to say one time for a fun time i love what you do and i want to support you no problem check the link in the bio you can buy me a coffee it keeps me up and keeps the lights on but with that said let's get straight into the satya gameplay I got y'all a spicy pot today with filled up with one of my Patreon members, not to mention uh, some of my uh, Discord members. So let's just have some fun. Let's let's do our thing. So let's join our compatriots. What's up, fellas? Hello. Y'all good? Yeah. Yes, sir. Definitely. Cool. All right, let's give me like one quick shuffle and then. Okay, good. Do y'all have two D6s by chance? Two D, absolutely, my guy. Okay, okay, absolutely. Look, um, would y'all yeah. like to roll for high, uh, roll for uh, turn, uh, roll, high roll for turn order, so slow down. Sure. Cool. <laughs> Four, you got it. All right, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna roll, let's see. I got a five. So a five. I need to see a one, oh, two, and a three. Oh, hey. an eight. Mm-hmm. What you got, chat? We're rolling 2d6. Yep. Oh, yeah. 
a six. These are oh yeah yeah you got it already, Chad. And an eight. Oh, oh nice. so Marvin right, and Chad we'll reroll real quick. Yeah. Okay. But yeah. Yeah, four. <laughs> Five. Okay. Oh, second. All right. Eleven. Eleven. So we got uh in turn order we have chat uh could you do this for the star trek if you go to your settings you can change player order it's going to go chad then marvin then ttc then star trekky let me flip you guys just kidding hmm. we got some hot spice in the pod today hey, what's the order again and one more one more time yeah it'll be chad marvin ttc and then star trekky all right thank you right. got that correct is that correct yeah, yeah sir we got some spicy so we got this is actually a really spicy pot we have norin the wary we have tim the thrasios cannot leave home without it we have the new satya and then we have bovarigmos og not fibble fit and bovarigmos 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 not the, it's not the original there's there's just Borb by himself but this is the enraged Borb. oh i bit. didn't know that how many how many iterations yeah. of them are there three i think only and oh. that's is, isn't that the one who like where the tournament was there was like a ruling because of the one guy named Boba Rigmus and he meant Enrage, but there's also one the original. So oh yeah, I heard about they had, that. Yeah, they, yeah. They had ruled, Mis like, OG misnamed. Yeah, yeah, misnamed. And yeah, I heard about that one. Man, <laughs> painful. Wait, what happened? Update. I don't know. What I don't. I didn't hear about this. Um, what happened? There was, there was, I don't know what it was like a Grand Prix or something like that. I really don't know. But there was like uh, like a pro match. And right. uh, one player played Piffing Needle and just said Bobo Rhythmus, but at the time the meta was like only Bobo Rhythmus enraged. So everybody met, knew, like, okay, it's like he meant enraged, but the other guys, like, judge, like, quick question, he said Bobo Rhythmus, this Bobo Rhythmus enraged. So the judge ruled that it's like the enraged thing uh, is not deactivated and he could, like, go through to his, like, I don't know, no. the like Really? Yeah. Yeah. And then he lost because of, like, he just not said Bobo Rhythmus Enraged and just Bobo yep. Rhythmus. Yeah. Hey. Makes sense. There is another card called just Bobo Rhythmus. And then, and, and then there was, like, a huge ruling that if it's very clear, I, I'm not very sure about that, but I'm, I, uh, Checking my second second. Keep I talking know. now. Me too. Yeah. As far as I know, there's, like, a ruling that if it's clear what you meant, you don't have to say the whole card name. got you got you that's that would suck if that happens but you know someone has right. to go through it to help everybody else because nowadays you know like yeah, i yeah. like the okay if it's clear and get yeah you'll understand what the intent of the deck is and whatever not so that's good to know all right now chad i want you to i want to see a clean turn to win I want to play as many games yeah, okay. tonight as possible to make up for last time so if you're not winning by turn that's two i don't fine. want you, i don't want you keeping that hand we understood we good Orin makes a fast game. <laughs> I got you. Yeah, no counter spells. Don't ask. <laughs> I'm not past a priority. There's red nothing green. to pass priority to. Uh, let's see. Red green. I, have, I got I have a reaction, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. I will. Uh, I will keep my second seven. This is playable. Uh -huh. I will keep my first seven. Man, no lands again. <laughs> Pile shelf killed me. <laughs> I, will, I will spoil and say it. There are a lot of lands in this deck. Spoiler. I lands and spells. That's what we playing, right? Lands and spells. More mm. than usual, especially for CADH. <laughs> I got you. I, I got you. Need, I kind of need it for my fuel a little, a little bit more than normal. So. Got you. Got you. Got you. Let's see. Never a worry. Never didn't have it. You always gotta make them have it. You know what I'm saying? Every time. Mm -hmm. Yo, TTC, man, I, you, you didn't, like, notice it, but I got a heart attack, like, almost. I almost died in my chair, man, because I saw the spice, right? And for a second, I was like, wait a minute, <laughs> are we playing CDH? But I only got CDH decks on this, at this place. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. And I'm like, wait a second. <laughs> I saw wait. the other two commanders, not yeah. yours. I was like, oh, hey, okay. I should wait. The wrong thing. <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> no, yeah, no, no. Um, Borborigmos is something. I don't play yeah, Enrage is something yeah. Trek has been talking about in the community. And yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah, Chad, just, like, like, I love Spice, but I was like very confused. <laughs> he was <laughs> like, uh, TTC, I don't like pub stomping. I'm like, I will, but like, <laughs> it's like, I'll, I'll do I'm it, ready. but I'm like, ready. <laughs> okay. Um, pregame so actions. Ready. 
I will show a pregame of Mr. Gemstone Caverns getting rid of Mr. Oh, Polluted Delta. Mm. Is that okay? Right. Yeah. Absolutely. Alrighty. Keep on keeping on. I'll draw. Let's get it started. an ancient tomb sounds good mm -hmm. two and play a smuggler's cop uh yep. what does that do again um it's a vehicle whenever it attacks or blocks oh, it can yeah. draw a card draw a discard, discard yeah. a card with crew yeah. one you passage go. sounds good all right then i will draw for turn <laughs> uh, let's see mm, misty rainforest Mm -hmm. uh, uh, let's right. pick it now. Yep. Uh, I'll control cut. I'll get a barju. Mm -hmm. And I'll also let you cast this little pedal. If that's good, I'll pass my turn. Yep. Uh, just during your end step, I'll just cast an enlightened tutor. Mm. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. Am I, I'm sorry. You still can cast your enlightened tutor. I'm very sorry. I'd let you cast my thoracic. Yes, that's, that's good. Oh, with the lotus bell in the land? Just yeah, justice. Yeah. That's good. Yes, that I'm fine. Sense. I'm fine with that. But yeah, I would still like to still cast light and tutor. Yeah, absolutely. All right. I think I'm just gonna find crypts because I did just get rid of the land, so I have to make up for Recover. lost time. There it is. And then crack this one. And this one. What land is that? Uh, Ground C? For me? For me, it's a bayou. Gotcha. I will untap upkeep. I'll draw the crypt and I'll attempt to cast the crypt. Is that okay? Uh, how many cards you got in your hand, Marvin? I got one, two, three, four, five, six. Cool. I'm just going to play Flooded Strand and uh, crack it. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. And I am going to change my play because Thrasio is obviously holding up Fierce Guardianship. I'll go get um, Losing a Life. I don't get to do yeah. this very often, but this is funny when you just don't have a one kind. I'm just going to cast a Grand Abolisher using a Tundra and uh, this Gemstones. You can counter it if you want. I don't really care. I'm passing if it comes to me. Sounds good. I will then pass the turn. There we go. Draw. Uh, we'll do a Tiga tapped into a bird. Pass on bird. Pass. Nice. All right. Pass turn. Yeah, let's keep a draw. I'll take two. Mm -hmm. We'll play a perpetual timepiece. Ooh, what the fuck is that? Yeah. I can tap it to mill two, and then I can pay two and exile it to shuffle any number of cards in my graveyard back in. Okay. Keep going. Shuffly, shuffly. Okay. I can get stuff back. Does it resolve? Mm. I assume it does. Yeah, I have no I have no effects. Okay with that. If you got a combo piece, yeah, you got a combo piece. You got it. Play a mountain. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. I tap the mountain for a Norn. Sounds good. Yep. I pass the turn. Alrighty. Untap. Upkeep. Draw turn. Hmm. Oh, oof. Oof. No, I'm sad. Oh, okay. Let's see. Mm. City of S. Sounds good. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I mean, we're chilling, right? So 100%. I'll pass my turn. I will untap, upkeep, and draw one play in Ottawara as my land for turn. Oh, cheated. Gripped. It's a five. Oh, odds are safe. It's a six. <laughs> I'm losing three. I always do odds are safe, but I forgot to declare it. New pod. So I'll pay three and I'll cast the spell I want to cast on turn one, but refuse to let it get fierce guardianship. I'll cast a rhystic study. Eurystic study. Yep. Yeah, okay. I was like, they, no one taps out on thrash yields, but the Lotus been on turn one about hold on from fierce. And now the Grand Abolisher is pointless. Pass turn. <laughs> okay. Step one comes Untap. back. Untap draw. Uh, we will do a uh, grove of the burn willows. Hmm, do I want to feed you a lot of cards? Probably not. 
Mm-hmm. Not uh, Whatever brings you one. joy, bro. Uh, you know, we'll, we'll see. Uh, one for a uh, Kyrian Ranger. Basically, uh, uh, Return of Forest. Uh, nope. All right. Draw a turn. And keep on going. Yep. Uh, Return of Forest. Uh, you control the owner's hand and then untap another creature. You can only do once per yep. turn. Uh, and then we will Norn do flickers a, away, uh, so yeah. I need to read Norn. Whenever a player passes a spell or a creature attacks, remove Norn from the game, return to the battle under as long as we try at end of turn. Okay. It's only once per turn, right, Trekkie? Yep, once per turn. Uh, and mm-hmm. then I will do a. Um... Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do a two mana for X equals to one for Chalice of the Void. Ooh, risk it's study. Off the uh, void. Yep, and I will oh. not pick that. I have no more mana. Yep, I I have to pass on Chalice on one. Pretty nice. That's gonna cut right. counter spells. <laughs> I'd like to. I'd like to interact here. Yeah. Go for it. I'd like to cast this fierce guy. No, I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. But it was kind of obvious. But yeah. <laughs> I was <laughs> like, bro, if I get this fucking. Yeah. If I was like, if my shit gets countered, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna cry, bro. Because <laughs> I'm not ashamed to show. I just drew two uh, lands off of the last two mystics that he needs. <laughs> I'm not afraid yeah. to show that. I'm passing on. I'm gonna let that resolve. All righty. Not surprised. Countered. Back to graveyard. I'm sorry. Uh, there's a uh, then... risk study on Fierce Guardianship. Go ahead. Uh, I would. Uh, hmm. Uh, you may have it. I'll draw one. Yeah. It's another land if that makes you feel any better. <laughs> Uh, that makes me feel better. Gonna... <laughs> I just threw three lands, so. <laughs> oh, there you boy. go. Keep on and keep on. Uh, yeah, I pass. On end step, I'm going to activate Perpetual Time. So I'm going to mill two. Mm-hmm. Okay, yeah, put the top two cards in your library and two. Pro Mox? Price of Progress. Mm-hmm. What is right, Price of... I, I'm going to stop that. I'm going to try to Price of Progress deals damage to each player equal to twice the number of non-basic lands. That... They, they control... Yes. Okay. It's kind of a kind of a bomb. Um, untap upkeep. Okay. I'll go to my draw. Play a mountain. Okay, I want to so crew the cop. Sounds good. I'll yep. swing three over at Marvin. I would three. One, two, three. Um, on attack trigger, I'm gonna mm-hmm. loot. Yep. One discarding a mountain. Okay. Yep. Combat damage goes through, I presume. Um. Then I will pass the turn. You are passing the turn. All right. I'd like to tap two. I'll get pinged by one from my city of S, and I uh, cast this Illidumbi's call. Ristic study. You may draw. Horns out. And I'm praying that the land. <laughs> it's, it's, I'm, I'm not real. This is just bad. Okay. This is the worst risk. I should have probably should have played this turn one. Yeah. Passing on Dalmry's call. Okay. Oh, no. Everybody good? no y'all don't, why didn't y'all hold up Mana for Tabal's trickery? God damn, bro. Dude, you asking me? <laughs> I was trying to stop people from casting his spells, but apparently. <laughs> well, let's I was see. preemptive, not, not reactive. I got you. I got you. This time. I mean, I yeah, think... got me this time. If he goes... Marvin is... Biscuit, biscuit, right? God damn it! There's no for this! I'm he just does this every fucking time! I'm a... I'm a... I mean, like, yeah, I mean, like... And he has... He <laughs> has to... Yeah, this is consultation, most likely. All right, so, yeah, this is most likely. I was like... I mean, like, it's very clear now, because that's why I, I couldn't, like, let this chalice for one slide. Yeah... Uh, no, 100%. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck, man. Marvin is... Bro, he does this so fucking good. All right. And if that's good, I'd like to draw my card. You're card. good, dude. Yeah. Alrighty. I tried. Oh, I got so fast. What land we play? Um, uh, I shocked in a hollow fountain. I lose two life. Um, and who the fuck needs protect protection, right? Nah, kids. I'm joking. Always protect yourself, but this time we're gonna raw dog this shit. Let's see. Ristic study. Right. Let's hope this is it. I lose one left. Uh, I will pay. No, I'm joking. <laughs> good. <laughs> Ristic study. Good. I'm going to cry for three. Yeah, man. This is it. This this is not Draw it. Draw away. Fuck. Damn. 
I have, to, I have to pass on chance, right? I have to pass on uh Thassa's Oracle. I don't have it. We all know that you will draw another card. So if that's good, I would I'd like to I would prior on the ETB. Yep. And I'd like to cast this classic consultation. Ristic study. You absolutely may draw. Let's see. But you also can deny it, right? Just for you. God damn, know. if I had one more fucking mana, I could uh, cast this stink of, sink of stupor that I just drew on the NUFC, okay. NDFC, but I, I'm going to be real. I didn't draw anything. Yeah, I have to pass on uh, risk, on, uh, I mean, on uh, the Station? consultation. Do we have anything for this? I know y'all are non-blue players, but. Oh, you're passing oh. priority to me? What a guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, no. We got it? Oh, no. No, he got it. I can spin it. I'll play a Mog Salvage for free. Uh, salvage, sure. Oh. oh. I'll so target you can draw the card. crit. Yeah. Mo oh, Risk Dick Study trigger first. I'll draw. I'm good Make to draw. Mm -hmm. We'll just reveal it off the top if it's that's no, it. Don't do it. It's a last don't chance. It. Nope. Oh. And oh, Crypt, there it is. Yeah, Crypt gets destroyed. Yeah, that's G. Good <laughs> shit, bro. Yeah, last I will, cards. I will name. Hopefully, I don't fumble. Did you have any interaction, Marvin, in your hand? I who knows? I don't know. Like, is it oh, oh, yeah. I'm, I'm declaring that I'm F6. I'm, I'm finally oh. declared this. Yeah, I'm F6. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's over. Yeah, you I had a breach of the wheel. I only had the, the fears and I top decked also the stunning, so I was very sad about tracking the pedal gotcha. because I don't know. But yeah. yeah, I had a call of cutting. That was on my opener, so I was like, hmm, it's between win and fierce guardianship. And just like, I only had, need to cast Thrustus. And then yeah. I got greedy by casting the Thrustus with the Lotus pedal, which was like. Damn. Man, that was good. Uh, all I had left in hand was I drew three lands. I wasn't bullshit, and I actually revealed those. I had a Displacer Kitten that was left in my hand, but I had nothing really to do that other than Flicker, Grand Abolisher. My last draws was Thassus, Lightning Runner, Sink the Stupor, and Last Chance. And I was another, mostly I could do maybe a Chain of Vapor and shit to change the Devotion, but it was Demonic Consultation. So that, yeah, I was nowhere near a Counterspell like. I don't regret my play of going Grand Abolisher into Ristic because I, I, my hand would have been bullshit if I didn't uh, get the Ristic down. But shit, you, I agree and, with Marvin. Sometimes you got to make him have it. So that and was either, good. Either way, I guess like the good thing for you is like I would have done the same play even without you, without revealing that you had headlands on the hand. Right. So. No, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. The reason I was I was revealing the lands is because I like I was like, bro, I have nothing to hide from these guys. I need them to feed my fucking risk study. Absolutely. Yeah, like I'm like, look, I like when Sir Trekkie was thinking about the risk. I'm like, I just drew a land, bro. Here it is. <laughs> like, yeah, and, we're also, and we're also playing chill, right? So like, yeah. we're not like sweating for like a tournament. Yeah, so. I mean, but even I would be even do this in a tournament. Like I I actually learned this from two pilots. One, uh, they just reveal cards in their hand, even on a tournament level. It's nothing, just like they just yeah, don't absolutely. care because if you yeah. have nothing to hide, it's just like look, like it just makes people like it just makes chills people out. yeah just it just chills them out be like okay what do i have to worry about you know what i'm saying and you, yeah and you can like uh, like in, in quotes i guess like force um um you can like enforce um like slow play or like responsible play because if you say like well guys i really have no kind of play like this yeah like I'm, I'm not okay I've yeah, even I'm heard uh, very last thing. I've even heard Tyler from Play to Win will literally be like he will reveal his hand to the table as a poli as a political move and say like, bro, these hit cards are yeah. bullshit, bro. Like I have nothing yeah. to do just to incentivize people to not interact with them when he's doing like a yeah. like a high kin in play. So yeah, are y'all yeah, down for another one? Oh yeah. Okay, hundred uh, percent. I'm gonna shuffle up. Y'all have two D D sixes once again. Absolutely. All right. Ooh, uh, seven. Six. Nope. I got no, seven as well. You said what? I got a seven as well. Okay. Four plus six. Okay, go. ten. So me and Marvin roll off to see who goes second or third. Yes, sir. I got a eleven. Where was this roll the first time? Well, yeah. I got an eight. Oh. All right. All right. Give me the order one more time. All right. So we have Chad. Oh no. Yeah, Chad going first. TTT going second. Marvin going third, and then Sir yes. Trek going fourth. There we go. I'm taking a look oh, at my second, second seven. seven. All right. And that's this ass as well. <laughs> I'm checking my first seven right now. I really thought that turn one risk was good, but the minute you changed their play, it was like, I'm going to go ahead and cast Rascals. I was like, fuck, he has a fierce guardianship. <laughs> like, I, I got a slow play so this. So nice. Yeah. I was like, I'll, I'll part of me thought about it. Like, the minute I thought about you holding no fierce guardianship, I was like, 
fuck i should say no i'm sorry you passed i'm like bro this is the homie bro fuck it like <laughs> uh let's see first seven is this playable everything is slipping it's a little slow that's the problem It's just this pod is actually not very good for what I think is from last game. Well, that's a two color deck. Uh -uh. I'm back. I took my first out of it. Keep it. Let's go with that into that. I'm gonna reveal this. I'm gonna throw it back. So, um, it's basically Scalding Tarn, turn one, hold open sores and have a Mox Opal, turn two, Archivist, turn three with the Rite of Flame, just draw a land in my first couple of turns to get double Archivist down and a Final Fortune. The only thing is, though, because of Chaz and Trek's deck, if they were playing three plus color decks, I would have kept this because of Fetch Lands. But they're like, I don't think Chad is going to run fetches, and I'm not sure how many fetches Sir nor how many tutors is going to do. So I'm going to throw this one back and go check out my uh, second seven. Maybe I'm tweaking, but yeah, this one's going to reveal that one. Hmm. Why wouldn't I run fetches? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I actually don't know. Like, I took the fetches out of my mono red deck, and so it's kind of like I, I don't know. I didn't like having to play around uh, opposition agent when I didn't really need to deck thin or fill my graveyard because I'm not on breach. So. I guess I could keep five, right? Hmm. Five is kind of hot. Five is a good number. Yep. Should be five. Fuck, this hand is really close. No lands, though. I'm going to throw this one back. Ship it. <laughs> Checking out my six. Oh, I loved it, too. I really liked that hand, but it was like literally my top card would have been a land draw as well, and it would have made the whole hand alert. But you can never look at the top card. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I like a, a guide into a talisman, into a fish, but then I was like, if I don't draw a land, I'm not playing this game, so it's not that deep. But sometimes you have to like take a peek, right? Yeah, I thought like, like when I've already decided to throw it back, I'll take a peek, but I'm like, you know what? What, yeah. was, the, what was the chances <laughs> I drew that city of brass off top? Let me see. All right, now if I was on Boba Rigmos, I'd take that gamble because I'm running what 30 plus lands, like so. Maybe. Let's see. <laughs> Maybe. Um, hmm. go to a five because yeah check out a five I'm muted for a second I just needs my nose no problem Turn one wheel for you, bro. <laughs> yeah, and I mean that—that's why we run reels to be able to do a deep mulligan. You know what I'm saying? So, a good thing I run wheels. So fuck it. Man, my hand is iffy. And I'm really sad because this could be a great six. Just like no okay, fine. 
Noit card feels really good on board. Imposing grandeur, because I get to wheel myself for eight. <laughs> what does it read? What does imposing grandeur read? Uh, yeah. Basically, each each player may uh, discard uh, and then draw up to the their commander that's in the well, on the border in the command. Oh, CMC. Oh. Mana value. Not, yes, mana yeah. value. Oh, yeah, that's dang. terrible. Yeah, that's like for, for one mana, two mana drops, maybe even four, it's pretty bad. But for eight, yeah, you know, that's great, right? See. Luckily, look at oh you my guys, fucking god, I, I maybe I, I'm gonna should have let me cut your deck, man. Bro, like, are you going down to zero? I have to go down to three. I drew the wheel, nah, but I god. drew zero lands, dude. I'm yeah, no, give us like, a pile, you know give us a pile. Bro, you, you'll be fine because you know what they say, what they say, right. Gets up three is better like an average than an average seven, right? So exactly. No, I agree. Like I'm like this is a real yeah. test of what the deck can do. Let's see. Every time I'm, you mulligan, do you ever look at the top card? Like, um, not every time. It depends. Like if it's like oh this land a land will make it good, then it'd be like fuck it. But if it like if it's like oh this is nothing no good. One. You yeah. said what? <laughs> oh. If it's nothing good, then doesn't matter. It, it literally doesn't matter. Is. Like literally, a top yeah. deck does nothing for me. <laughs> Bro, I'm sending I'm sending energy right now. So you you will hit those the land the I just want to land. That's and, all. Like I've gone uh, three. I literally could I literally could have kept the first seven, but I hate that energy because it's like I'm not gonna keep a a, a, a mediocre first seven to just yeah, be afraid to go true. down even deeper. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like it's land, too much variance. A fish in this. and a misstep for the misstep. <laughs> literally, <laughs> that's the perfect three. Literally, <laughs> literally. All right, I'm gonna give you uh, Chad. Give me piles, brother. Cut number two and a half. Okay. <laughs> now do three on top of one. Okay. That's the bottom pile right takes seven. You said what? The bottom pile takes seven. Off the top? Yes. Okay. Set it aside. Okay. And then put that seven on top of the top pile. Put okay. that on the bottom. Put that on the bottom. <laughs> and then bam. <laughs> That's that's this your like bad hand. Bad yeah, hands man. on bottom. Oh, okay. oh I so th so this goes oh. on top. Yep. Okay. Yeah. So. Oh, okay, I see what you that's did. You said like you just gave me an extra free mulligan. I got you. That's, no, that's, I gave the trash. That's the right there. <laughs> he drew Let's the bad see. seven just to throw it away without looking. One. <laughs> see, he's keeping. That's a good hey, hand. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> One. Definitely. I mean, it's got a fish. It's got to have a fish. Two. Uh, Four wheel. Three. I mean, it, it has a fish in the hand. Wow. He's grinning in, inside. I will put these four on the bottom and keep this three. Already, uh, any pre-games? Nope. Nope. If I pre-game this hand, Wait, I don't know what the ah, fuck. No. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Stop, stop. All, all you guys stop in your tracks. I'm very uh, used to saying no, but I definitely got it. Ah, there it is. Hey. Hey. But I'm very sad because I have to pitch this move in here. Damn. Already, I'm gonna draw. Yep. I kept this hand for the haters. Okay. I'm gonna fetch. Oh. Prismatic. <laughs> Throw out a mountain, and I'll cast my commander. Pass on. Yeah. I'd like to see you guys do a turn one commander. Pass a turn. <laughs> Untap. Okay, I'll draw one. Wait, I did. I did last if round. Only. <laughs> if only. I will I uh, play a steam Vince tapped, and I'll pass turn. Oh. Yeah. Wait, wait, what is happening? <laughs> it's right. it's going down to a mold of three for a playable oh, hand. Nice. That's what I did. <laughs> hmm. This doesn't do me any good, right? Wait, let me think here for a second. Mm -hmm. Um and he wins I the mean, game right here. Uh, right here, right? I wish. I mean okay. please, like the faster he wins, the faster we oh. can get to the next game. <laughs> Look, uh, I got none, no coin here, so just imagine there's a luck counter on this card, okay? That's cool. Um, I'd like to cast this imp seal. Pass on a period, so if imp seal is good, I'll lose two life. I'll put something sweet on top, which I won't tell you, don't try. Uh, and then I'm passing. I'm gonna be turn. honest, y'all. Marvin is known for going thosis, just winning out of nowhere. I promise you, this I'd is a thosis, bro. Never <laughs> have <tried. laughs> What right. are you talking about? My guy. <laughs> yeah, he's good. Yeah, yeah, he's passing turn. Okay, draw. 
Yes, sir. I'm you may want to wait for, but well, he knows what he's getting. I guess just let him throw the card. I, I know what I'm. I'm I, yeah, right, yeah I'm, you can. You can. You can also wait. If I drew, and I can think about my turn in the meantime. So that's yeah, fine. go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. Wait, I'm uh, definitely no, getting this card right here, which is like right here. How dare? Okay. It's a, and Imperial says, uh, Imperial says, Imperial Seal says, when you gemstone caverns, you have to reveal the card and keep it revealed oh, yeah. for the ah, remainder yeah. of the game. Yeah, all right, all right. And my opponents can cast it for any mana, right? Yes, yes, yes. We can cast it if you, if we get to your turn before you get to your turn. <laughs> uh, we'll start with a uh, command tower, tap into soul ring. Yeah, nice. pass on soul ring, bro. Pass on soul ring. Untap, upkeep, a draw. Let's just keep it going, dude. I'm gonna crack my fetch. That's hot. Yeah. Keep on and keep it on. Yep. I'm gonna dash in Ragavan and swing at more. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> You're serious? Nah, he's joking. Nah, he's joking. time piece. Another heart attack almost, man. Then I'll pass it. All right, I'll untap. I'll keep out draw one. I will play a tundra and then pass her. A tundra. All right, untap. I'll keep draw. Oh, I have to act as if I don't know the card. Oh man, I am. What was it? No. Wait. Whoo. Sheesh. You'll find out some sometime at some time. I'll cast this for us. Pass on Thrasios. Uh, pass my Don't time. say it. Don't think. Thrasios, pass you. That's it? Mm hmm. Yes. All right. That sounds like fun. Uh, we'll do a... Shocked in Stopping Ground. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why am I 36 uh, still? I'm at 40, that's funny. Need a reset. Yeah. <laughs> need a reset. <laughs> uh, I'm so busy I, 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 did, I forgot to I, change my life to No, I did. <laughs> Oh yeah, can I, I think I'm about, I should start at 50, right? 50, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> sure, I, yeah, why not? Hmm. Try something new. We'll, we'll, we'll try this. Uh, we're gonna put two down for a Cinder Vines. What's it's that? Cinder it's a, it's an old, it's a, it's not a great card, but it's something fun. When an opponent casts uh, whenever... a non-creature spell, deals one damage to that player, pay one, destroy target artifact or enchantment, deals two damage to that permanent so control. Yeah, anti-breach. That's like Keep a very on, gruel enchantment. A very gruel enchantment. Anybody let it through? Yep, so pass on it. All right, yeah. that passed turn. Uh, and steps, I'm going to activate my petrol timepiece to mill two. Sounds good. Inventor's Sounds Fair, good. Gorilla Shaman. Gorilla Shaman. Okay, okay, okay. Tap upkeep. Oh yeah, the raw. Uh, yeah, it's artifact. I guess we just go for it. Mm -hmm. um, Lions I die. Pass another key. <laughs> Worse. Magus of the Moon. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. That's only when he gets the T. I'll lose yeah. one off of Cinder Vine. Oh, thank you. Ah, I'm at the help of upkeep. And I'll go to my end step. Warren's back. Passage. All right. Untap. Upkeep. Draw one. And then we will pass turn. Okay, so I guess all oh, I can't, right? 
But I have to. And I'm so sad right now. Everything is F right now. Everything is red. Yeah, and everything is red right now. Play a mountain. Fuck. Oh, it's bad. <laughs> okay. Wait, do I. Am I running this card? <laughs> what for you, right? Mm hmm. Yeah, no. Okay, okay, but wait, we we like like we used to adapt, right? Adapt mm -hmm. to situation. I'm gonna cast this chrome mob. Pass on it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I, HB, I will imprint the demonic consultation, which I not impaled for, obviously. But that's the thousands you impaled sealed for. No, I am for this one. Oh. So because we all know. He didn't, but he did. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. Uh, so. Um, I got a black right now, which is nice, which is nice. Uh, I'd like to... Alrighty. Big brain time. Go ahead, Trek. Uh, take it away. Uh, I'm sorry, right. you do take one off of Cindervine. Oh, for, yeah. Uh, yeah, you do. Yeah, thank you. I need to be better about that. I it's funny because we all, since we all know what's what would have come, yeah, but I got it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, no, that magazine yeah, right? one was kind of like, ah, I don't run any bases, yeah. but it's like, ah, that stops my argument, I guess. Like, yeah. the, a longer game is good for me because then I have more time to get my uh, two mana rocks on board. So, yeah, no reason to complain. Well, uh, we'll do a uh, mountain, aka Misty Rainforest. All um, right. <laughs> uh, and then we'll do just a little bit of. Four oh, mana. And I lost my life, right? Because it's in the yes, 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 yes. Uh, four mana for a one ring. Pass in the one ring. Very cool. Very Way cool. to go. Very cool. There we did it. Mm -hmm. we, we got it out. And then now I will pass turn. Gain protection until your next turn. Yada, yada, yada. Yeah, that, yeah that's <laughs> Borb's <laughs> game right there, bro. I'm chilling. Blue players can't, yeah, blue players can't interact. <laughs> he just and got card draw. Yeah, that, that, yeah. I'm going to oh, mill myself for two with my time piece. I'm going to get to go ahead and do that. Yeah, you good, brother. You good. Simeon Spirit Guide, no. All okay. right. Untap. Keep. Draw. I'm going to play a mountain. I'm gonna play a Bergy. Pass on Bergy. I pass on Bergy as well. I pass as well. I will go to my end step. No mm -hmm. one's back. Mm -hmm. I will untap, upkeep, draw one. Uh, yeah. Spoken to existence. Talisman of creativity. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, you got a different color now. There yeah. you go. I'd, pass on. Because it resolved. <laughs> In end step, I'd like to have this one for a black. I'd like to cast a Svam Tuna. I fucking love to cast a Svam Tuna. I'm not for Taylor Pike. <laughs> Alrighty, if that's good, I'll lose two life again, and I'll put something on top. Mm -hmm. That was the uh, uh, that was a non-creature spell, so you take one from Cinder Vines, yeah? Oh, and I take one off Cinder Vines as well. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, let's see. I gotta be better. No, you good, you good. Not. It's hard not being a person. <laughs> oh, there we go. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure to be honest if I run Arcane Signet. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hmm, but I wish. You I hope should that be. Is. I thought I thought that was unless you're like on oof, I thought everybody ran arc at least arcane. Yeah, maybe maybe it's not the case, right? Um, uh, I don't know. Well, no, I, I thought that was at least the case. Mm. Nah. Mm. Nah. <laughs> Color fixing. <laughs> nope, I'm I'm not. But it's fine. It's not. It's good. You got a talisman, don't you? I could. Do you really just have 40 copies of Thousand's Oracle and 20 copies of Tainted Pact in uh, <laughs> the year no, deck? That's how this works. 
<laughs> so I might as well. Hmm. Oh wait, I could do this, right? I mean, who needs? Wait, did I? I saw something else, which is also very good. Um, now to find it again, there it is. I'll take this one right here. But let me check real quick, just to be like very sure. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's also the reason I started the card in, so why not uh, stress test it? Alright. This one is shuffled, this one is going on top. Mm -hmm. And then we can go to my turn. Okay. Alrighty, untap. <laughs> no upkeep effects. Drop it. Mm, obviously, I will play the card. Tap, three, lose two life, Phyrexian Metamorph. Ooh, pretty hot. Okay. Phyrexian Metamorph. Oh, I'm it's sorry, it's coming as a copy is the one ring. How many cards are in your hand, Arvin? One, the, the, the known Tassas. The creature, yeah? I'll show you a Pyroblast. Oh, bro, why? I got only Tassas, man. Don't do me like that. I'll pass on Pyroblast. I'm, I'm passing it for man. <laughs> you take one from Pyro, uh, from Thunder. Yeah, take that shit, man. You did it to yourself. <laughs> one damage, man. Yeah. No, I'm just like sad that. Oh I'm man, this is impeccable. That's good. No, not good. I'm fine. <clears throat> Passing turn. Yep. All right, Passing on your end stuff. I'll one tap one the one ring to draw. Go ahead. And I will go to my upkeep and take one from the one ring. Hmm. There we go. And tap on keep. And now draw for turn. I should have gone for the spring leaf drum, man. <laughs> <laughs> I just heard that. I was so focused. Like, what is he going to do with all these cards? He's like, man, I should have gone for the, the spring leaf drum. Uh, we're going to do two. Oh, or fuck, man. This is why I keep you around, Marvin, bro. Arcane Signet. That's an Arcane yeah, Signet. I, I, I drew it for like base, Like, based in my, in, my, in my suffering or like in my agony? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and we're just going to go full, full tilt here a little bit. Spending three. No, don't do it. Whatever. Or a uh, Horn of Greed. How do we all draw out of this, you know, a little bit? Whenever a player Wait, draws okay. a land, whenever sure. a player plays a land, that player draws a card. That's crazy. Yeah, I will. Plays a oh, no, no, I have player plays a mountain. Yes. Uh, mountain, yes. I'm playing another mountain, aka the uh, proxy shifting woodland that's coming out. Nice. Uh, that's yeah, hot. I, because I played it, I draw a card. Sounds good. How many cards do you have in your hand by now? Man? I'm now at four. Six with the one ring. Yeah, one, six. two, three this turn. Six with the one ring. Not gonna lie. Say again? Tap that one ring. Dump that. I, I I might do a little a little bit later, but I, I kind of I kind of like it where it is right now. Uh, but I will help everybody out a little bit. So if anybody's got a dock side, you're welcome to play it. I'll play a lion's eye diamond. All right, pass on LED. Uh, Ooh. down to three cards in hand, and I will uh, pass turn. I have Sounds two mana. good. In step, Norn comes back. I'm gonna activate perpetual timepiece. I'm gonna mill two. First mirror, price of progress. Mm -hmm. Untap, upkeep, drop. I'll play a mountain and I'll draw a card. All You're right. Forced to draw. It's not a main. <laughs> so I'll put a little police on on that one and on center lines. <laughs> that made this game a little interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm I want to cast draw cards. a Jessica's Will targeting T. All right, I got four cards in hand. I pass. I on do Jessica's control play. my commander as I'm casting this. And you take one from Cinder Vines. Yep. Yeah. Is Jessica's will good? I'm passing on Jessica's will. Absolutely. Exiling a mountain, a strip mine, and a winds of change. Oh, kind of hot. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I like it. I like it. Winds of change, man. Get the blue players back in the game with Boar about to take over, bro. 
No, I do have no. A red I have mana. three cards in hand. What am I gonna do? You have five what in hand, I... bro. You have five in hand. Don't, don't, no, don't. I have don't three piss on this right college What are you talking, about? Bro. What are you talking you about? You have five cards in hand. You're just choosing not to have five, bro. Don't, don't piss on this college break, college break, bro. <laughs> No, no, no. All, all I'm going to have is just three because Lion's Eye can maybe discard them all. Come on. No, bro. And Don't I would piss on this and call it Ray, bro. I, I would just cut my Sasas, right? Get one card. Maybe it's like a land or some shit. Like no, he shuffles it back no, yeah, in. You're, it's you're 100% correct. You're 100% correct. I was just, I'm, I'm having fun. I would have. No, I know. I know. I know. They right, call right. me instantly. I'm like, no, no, no. I would have been messing. Been yeah, messing. no. Winds of Change shuffles back in. Each player no, okay, shuffles it. Yeah, yeah. Equal to the number. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I checked. Yeah. Reading the card, explain the card. I'm gonna play a goblin engineer. That is hot. Yeah. Uh, you paid yep. two for that, or was you had a floating mana? I had a floating yeah, mana off of Burgi. Got you, the Burgi. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then four from this. Got you. Um, been cast I'm, yet? I'm passing on goblin engineer. I got you. Pass here. You, uh, yeah. Once the change has not been cast, correct? That was just an exile? Uh, yeah. No. It is an exile. Yeah. He's probably not casting it then if he's playing Goblin Engineer. I mean, if you play, he's going to get more more mana from a little bit of red mana every time he casts something. So Yeah, not nah, like he's going to put something in the graveyard and Winds of Change shuffles it back in. He's not planning on casting the Winds of Change. Sure. If, yeah. Plus, it re if it refills our hands, and yeah, it just yeah, I think at this point, if he really wants to like keep being the stacks player, he just says, "No, nah, fuck your hands, bro." Because if you had good cards, yeah. you, you would have played them. So yeah, which the I think is a viable strategy. Yeah. Just say, Thank "Fuck you. everybody's hands." Unless he has some tech to give his creature haste, that would be interesting. We'll see. Cross that bridge when we get there. Overlord is saying energy and CDH. Hell yes, yes, we are doing energy. We unfortunately had to mold down to three though, and so we kept two lands, and it doesn't matter at this point. We kept two <laughs> a two land hand on on three. Is like at least I can hit my land drops, and so yeah. Which is something I activate the end of the actual day. timepiece. Am I good to mill two? Yep. Absolutely. I got a special. Does anybody People. think that that card is needing to be deleted? I don't know. I mean, it looks like he's going for breach lines. I don't think you delete that card. Just wait for him to play the breach. All right. That works for me. Yeah, I'll pass. Go for it. Yeah. I'll we'll use three mana. And have two. Yeah, I'll the same thing. I was just curious. No, no, you good. Yeah, no, I wasn't. I didn't mean to say you know that I mean? in, a, uh, in a bad way. Oh, yeah, you're good. You're good. Yeah. I'm going to flashback this Faithless Looting. I'm passing on Faithless right, Looting. Okay. I pass as well. You take one. Yeah. And you still get one Bergy mana, right? Yeah. Yes. He's got the counter on it now to show the mana. Mm. I'll discard a mountain and a mountain. Okay. Overloaded with mountain. By as we all. Mm. We'll use a floating red mana. Skull clan. Okay. Mm. Sounds good. Yep. Sure. Oh, that allows him to if he's infinite mana, mana, he can infinitely draw his deck with Norin, I think. I'll attach the skull clamp to the Magus of Moon. So Sounds I don't good. You have a very three long. one. And I'm going to go to my end step. Sounds good. What did you end up putting in your graveyard with Goblin Engineer? Cloudstone Curio. Oh, cool. Cool. All right. Oh. All right. I will untap, upkeep, and I'll draw one. I will. Doc. Hmm? He's looking for, for Doc. See if he can get the Doc shenanigans. I will. Uh... I mean, Cluster and Curio has some synergy with Goblin. Oh, there's there's some other ones too. I think. Yeah. <laughs> you're fine. You're fine. Do you got? Uh, just pass turn. Oh boy. Oh yeah. We we are like like. We're it's fucked. Like what a great yeah, game. We are, we are check those you guys games. can scoop at any time. I don't believe don't in scooping. I don't want to take that pleasure away from you for yeah. winning, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come on, bro. That's no fun. I would love to activate That's what I love about CDs because you don't have to complain about stacks pieces because we all signed up for them. It's just like, yeah, we just, Absolutely. yeah, it's a stacks piece. That's what we want to do. We want to do the most powerful thing possible.
we know what we're getting into, right? Exactly. It's so, like he's alright, back to the moon. Ah, uh, alright. But it's like but still everything's fucked, man. Good luck <laughs> that <they're> drop. <laughs> it's like playing Thrasios, man, at this point. No, I'm good, like no, it's fine. At least you got Thrasios out. Man. Like I would love yep, yep, yeah. I'm, absolutely, bro. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I will tap an arcane signet to play worldly tutor. Okay. Anybody want to react to that? Nope. Nope. All right. Let's go look for a lovely little dark side. Mm. Put that on top here. Since you guys do get to know, I'd love to not tell you, but. Not the top half. Mm -hmm. Isn't the top of my library? I'm be so sad. Okay, not that close. Sounds good. Shuffling, shuffling. And then I got one more thing to do, which is unsurprising to anybody. Two cards. You're going to draw two cards. Alright. Tap. Draw two. Go ahead. Finishing uh, up end step, going into untap upkeep. Yep. And draw. Mm-hmm. Well, I finally have a real forest, which lets me force to draw a card. Pretty good. Mm -hmm. Yep. Alrighty. Let's see what we can do here. Unsurprising to anybody else here as well, we will do a... Uh, let's just do a red and a red for a mm -hmm. dock side. Give me that count. Pass on dark side. Got one. Yeah. I got one as well. I have three. Three? So five treasures. I'm going to respond to the ETB. You got it. Whoa. <laughs> I'll crack Lion's Eye Diamond for three white. And I'll activate right. Perpetual Timepiece. Okay. I'm going to okay. target Curse Mirror, Pyroblast. Jessica's will. And why not? Faithless looting. I'm gonna shuffle those back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright. So I have one still gets now. one and then what's the other count? So be one, two. One, one, one. Yeah. Yeah. Three. So it'll be three total? Yep. Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh, is that any, anything else you wanna do? Nope, I'm passing on the ETB. Take All right. three treasures. Three treasures, that works for me. All right, three, got some things to do. Let's do this. Uh, we got a one mana drop, one floatus floating still for divine top. Pass yeah. the top. Yep. Pass, uh, uh, pass spend, the, spend the other floating to look at top three. Reorder. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We will do this, this order, put that back on top, no pun intended, uh, and then we'll play a, uh, I'll play the forest return, correct? Yep. Yes. Last turn. Right, I was this turn, good. I was making sure I didn't miss a land drop. Uh, that's all I wanted to make sure I didn't miss. Uh, and then we will do a, uh, three mana from cracking lion's eye. And you're dumping your hand. I will dump my hand. Yes. I was, I can do that right now. Uh, discarding what colors we want. Like list, oh, yeah. uh, cavern of souls and wind sub heat. Okay. AKA more, AK more mountains. Uh, so three, four, five, six, seven. And then one for eight. Alrighty. Pass the board. 
And LED the, goes to graveyard, funnel, right? right? Yeah. Say it one more time. LED goes to graveyard, right? Oh yes, correct. I was just making sure I did that all correctly. You good? Uh, uh, pass priority on board. I will Funny. just uh try to get my what's it called? Because you don't have any cards in your hand, do you, Chad? Nope. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this now because yep. I'll cast a pact, hold priority, pay a blue, and cast an offer you can't refuse, targeting my pact. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Get some mana. I like it. I'll show you a red elemental black. Yeah, Just exactly. <laughs> All right. <laughs> is uh, the pact okay on offer? You're good. Yep. All right. Good. Um, I'll make two treasures, and I'm passing on Borborigos so and think with the, with the or Borborigos in right here. Yeah, it's just enraged. It's Mr. Enraged over here. Yeah, I'm so uh, used to the Borborigmos and Fibblethip because like of that one that came out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and I, I'm just gonna make it simple for now. I'm just gonna straight up one ring, draw three. You're good. Yep. Keep on and keeping on. I know what they are, surprisingly. Um, okay, okay. Uh, and then we are going to bend one more. For top to look at top the next top three. Go ahead. Awesome. Now I know. Uh I will And I lost two life off casting two not creature spells. Correct, yes. I was not keeping track, but I trusted that you would. <laughs> uh because I was more about getting this out. I had a little heart attack on the self force. Uh go nah. ahead. Start. <laughs> No, I was really like, like, yeah, Chad doesn't have any cards again. I'm just going to waste these two counter spells right now because I top decked the offer last turn. So I was like, fuck this shit. I just want to. If I do draw something, at least I can cast spells now. Bro, I would take those two treasures now. You say what? I also would take those two treasures. Shit. Not going to lie. They look thanks to the fuck. I'm going to skull clamp my commander. <laughs> yep. Yep. He's gonna die. I'm gonna draw two. That's good. Sounds good, sounds good. Okay. I'm gonna play a cursed mirror. Hmm. Oh, I guess. Yeah, I'm not cracking my treasures, boys. Nah, that's fine. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Just do it. No. <laughs> we lose to this. We cross that bridge when we get there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the fact that he I'm drew that curse mirror after well. shuffling it in was just magic. I'm being honest. I'm not cracking my treasures. I'm passing on the cast yeah, and ETB. All right. I'll have a board. I got, right I, I got a lot. So uh, oh, wow. I have five. I have one, two, three, four, five. Six, yeah, you seven. may crack your treasure if you want. Is, I'm oh, but it's a bubble ring, no? Uh, so what did I misheard it? Oh, you're copying Borb? Is that what you said? Yep. Yeah. Oh. oh. Okay. Okay. Sure. Okay. I'm going to go straight to combat. I'm going to swing Borbergnos at you, Trekkie. All right. Sounds great. Just block with you. Like uh, block. Uh, no. Alrighty. <laughs> Through the top three cards. Right at the end, right before combat. I'm gonna tap dividing top to draw a card, swap it out. So top's on top, just doing that for simplicity. Okay. When it deals combat okay. damage to a player, reveal the top three cards of your library and put all land cards. And I will discard one land, two land, and kill board. I will okay. respond. Before okay. Oh yeah, before damage. Before damage, yep. I'll activate Goblin Engineer. Swap it out. Yeah, it's not an artifact anymore. It, while it's a creature. Yeah. Oh shit! Yeah, curse murder oh. is, is not a. It's not like uh, for example, what's it called? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. So so unta right? Yeah, it's not. Yeah, unta yeah, it's not. It's not a legal target. Target. Yeah. All right. Let's go to the graveyard. Yeah. Seems like that. I'll pass the turn. All right. That was mm -hmm. cool. I never thought about someone copying board before. <laughs> no, I'm <honestly>. fucking weak. <laughs> I will just untap, upkeep, and draw one. Uh, I, you took one, right, for Cinder Vines for casting Curse Mirror? Did now. Bro. You guys are stuck. 
<laughs> Let's see. I will just just a little bit. Pass the turn. Keep on keeping on. <laughs> Love it. There he is. All right. Untap. Upkeep. Nothing in my upkeep. I'll draw. This might be a land. Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> if it is, you get to draw. It? Marsh, and uh, Marsh Mountains. And you get a draw. Actually, you're forced to draw. Yeah. So maybe it's mm -hmm. another one <laughs> for it's next turn. Weird. No, it's not, but it's fine. <laughs> I got my Marsh Mountains right here, and that's good. Alright. <sighs> I'll pass my turn. <laughs> Alright. Untap. Upkeep, draw, finding top, which you guys all saw earlier. It's not revealed technically, but I just do that for over over the board. Um, and then we will do a um, tap in command tower for putting top back out. And we'll just do a little peek. Actually, we'll not do that. We'll just do soul, soul ring. That's an easier way to do that. Mm -hmm. Pass cast and then look. Anybody else? No offense. Nope, you go ahead. You're good. All right. I assume it's not. Since last time there was nothing. I'm Ooh. just hoping someone is winning. Like, <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to push it. I'm trying to push it. Um, we will do a. Uh, we'll just instantly crack a divining top to draw mm -hmm. a card and put it on top. Yep, I'm passing. Anybody else? No effects. Great. I will then spend one, two, three, four, five. Soul ring is tapped. Four, five. That's five right there. Mm -hmm. um, for a uh, the card I just spoke about earlier, a uh, imposing granger. Each player may discard their hand and draw cards equal to the greatest amount of value of a commander that they own in the command zone or on the battlefield. Um, I will be drawing eight cards if this results. Or I've used two of my, my counter drills. I, I have to pass on this when it gets to T. Is there something color worthy? I mean, like... yeah, for me, it would be like what discard for, draw for. Maybe discard yeah, for me, it's like for. discard, discard, just draw two, right? Nah, you good. Are you, I will. Jeff? I'll take you up on it. We'll take it up on it? Nice. Uh, as us, uh, yeah, we'll do that. So discarding that, drawing eight, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cool. That goes to the graveyard. Full grip. Um, and then we will do a little bit of uh, having that going to drop four. Sounds good. Try my best, guys. Here we go. And then we'll spend this, this one. Treasure and Arcane Signet. Try to cast Collector Ophi. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. Yeah. That's just hilarious. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> okay, but in re wait, but you're casting it, right? Yep. Yes, I'm casting it. Yep. Okay, in response to not resolved. If you want the game to end, you might want to let it go through. But no, like nothing? we're not we're playing no. to win. We're not playing to end the game. Like I said, we're not complaining. No one's complaining about a stack piece, bro. I know. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> if you want the game to end. I'm going to activate Thrust instantly because my Chrome Locks will be off then, right? Alrighty. Your Chrome Locks okay. taps for black. Just... For black. Yep. Alright, let's see. <laughs> Funny. I will reveal this. Not the same mountain. Yeah, nice. and then I'm good. Alright, uh, priority uh, will go back around to me, right? Okay. Yep. Party goes back around to me. I will first pay two, crack a treasure, and no, it's not crack. Yeah, I just pay two, lose a life, and okay. I will just cast an intuition in response. And take one from the center box. Yep. Intuition, okay. Yep. Yep. I'm gonna go search my library for trace cards. Thrice. Land, land, and land. Nice. <laughs> I could do that. Bit.
gonna do? What you gonna take? Uh, I'm gonna. I was gonna ask if Marvin would give me an ancient tune if I played it. Uh, if I found an ancient tune, <laughs> would, you would you give? Would you, would you give me an ancient tune if I go look for a land? If, if you explain to me why it's a good like. If it oh, be, good reasons, oh, I might. I mean, it doesn't matter. It's a mountain ancient tune either way. So I mean, it it's really doesn't matter. Mountain. It's a mountain. <laughs> right. Did you just get a removal spell? Dude? Yeah, mm, there's no reason like... to. What do you mean there's no reason to? <laughs> there's no there's a reason. fucking fat clock on the board. No, I mean, bro, I'll be honest. I and, can't. And I, 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 I am too. I have, I have, anymore, I have right? been behind the game the entire game. I cannot play control for you, big dog. I can't do it. <laughs> Not for you guys, bro. I'm, I'm too far behind. Right. I think no, wait, that what I do. Yeah. Let's see. We can politic this out. We can make a deal, dog. <laughs> see, I think actually what I want to do is. Yeah. Well, that's that. I could do that. I think what I'll do is. Uh, deal for what, bro? What you got to say, Chad? I can get rid of my magus. For you can get rid of your magus. You can get rid of this board rig boost. I would love if you got rid of your motherfucking magus, because then I could cast fucking spells. At least my commander, at least. <laughs> You good on that? I, I go. He's doing intuition you right good? Now. You good no, on he's that? intuitioning for the spot. That's what I'm saying. Because I, I got a source to plowshare. There's nothing really Trekkie has to say. He has, a, he's a stacked board dockside one ring. So if I go get the uh, source to plowshare, you give it to me. I float the mana to kill the uh, what's it called? Collector. For yeah, to to, uh, to kill the collector, Chad. We good on that? Uh, oh, I can't do it. You said I what? I can't do anything about the collector. Roof. No, I'm saying I can kill the collector if you can kill your magus, bro, to get this game going. I don't give a fuck about a collector roof. Oh, okay, man. Hell yeah, the hundred percent. Well, screw me then. <laughs> Let's see. I'm going to go get. Why, well, ask Marvin? You want to get? You want to say fuck this collector roof, bro? The Magus hurts more than the Oof. I can't stop the yeah. Magus. I'm gonna be honest, fully. Yeah, like I, I think the Collector Oof is more problematic. For the deal me. isn't over the Oof. The deal is over Borborigmos. Why, why would I kill Borborigmos? Because you want your lands to be lands again. Well, he don't what, he don't make it The Borborigmos does a, nothing for a land what, like, no, 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 the Borborigmos does the nothing. Magic. It's an outlet. What am I missing? Yeah. It does yeah. literally nothing. The Borborigmos is an it's outlet. for a swing for seven. I'm not the problem. I don't give a fuck if he hits me for seven. Like, I don't even use my <laughs> life total life. No, I think there's I, nothing achieved from that. He's been at 34 for a while. He's fine. <laughs> yeah, like, I, I'm not very... I really don't much care off the uh, what to call it shit. Um, but I will either way do this. I will... Because if I do... Yeah, because if I draw Underworld Breach naturally, then this does. Either way, I'm going to target Marvin to... Uh, Put, you can put a sword to my hand. You can put mm -hmm. a shit land or a shit land or a sword. No, 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 no. Because in, in in the universe that I actually do, what's it called? Okay, grab a sword. You can go find a basic. Yeah. His basics are. Metal. I don't play. I don't play basics, bro. I know. I know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Put in the um, new model. Let's right? go. Yeah. Let's speed this up. Let's go get that. And I know I want to get a. The freeze? I think I want to get a freeze and I want to get a a lead. Yeah, if you're planning to draw natural into a breach, then I guess that's fine, right? That's the best line I have going right now for me. You know what I'm saying? So, but you you are not down to target the Magos, right? So you're more like of, of a oofy kind. I'm of going for type, the oof, right? yeah. Like because either way that that LED. gets that gets you back on your what's it called thing. I'm gonna kill the. I'm gonna combo. float a white man. I'm gonna kill the. Uh, what's it called? The oof. Way, first of all, that for me that sounds very bad. <laughs> Why? <laughs> because I'm, I don't know. I'm getting the feeling that I'm enabling you. Wait. And either way, either yeah. way, you get your mana. Either way, you know what I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. True. 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 Uh, I, mean, I, I, I can make a deal. I can make a deal with you. I can delete the collector before your turn. By the way, if you let it go through uh, to thunders, I can delete my own creatures at any time i got lands you can delete anybody's creature i i hear that and 
I don't see a reason why we listen to Trek on anything. He's drawing five on his next round. How many cards do you have in your hand right now, Trek? I can't, actually, I cannot see the collector's up, but I have 11 right now. Yeah, I don't yeah. think we listen yeah. to anything Trek is saying. Marvin, are you okay yeah, with giving yeah. me the source yeah, yeah. of Cloudshare, bro? That's fine. I mean, I'm I'm technically down, but I wish you would talk the the, the Magus, but yeah. I'm, I'm getting fucked to on lands too, so like I I, I feel because I'm gonna be honest, I the Magus does unlock things, but then I feel like the the Magus unlocks Trek more than the uh, the what's it called thing does. I mean, granted, the Oof turns off his ring, but I just I don't see a reason. So I will just still in response to the magus float one white off one treasure and then uh let me i'll pass on the what's it called i am p -p 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 passing priority all right yeah okay. i have a white flying right. you do yep uh and i will give the opportunity to use it i will play my land for turn military tower Keep Actually, that's not, that's, that's, that isn't that is music stack. I forgot about that for a second. Wait, what? But I will. Called? I just played a land for turn, military tower. Mm -hmm. Yeah, draw trigger play. on the stack. Draw trigger on the stack. Oh yeah, draw trigger, draw trigger on the stack. You good to draw? Okay. Uh, and then I will uh, tap the one for a uh, mining top. Pass on top. Uh, and then I will go to combat. Yep. And I will. In response, I'll just you. Yeah, yeah, I just will. I will just pop the yeah. oof though. I'll attempt to. Sounds great. Yeah. Thank you. You gain two. Uh, I gain two glorious life. All right. Uh, seven longer. coming at you. Seven coming at your commander damage. All right, me at the dome. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You're all good. Trigger combat damage. I get to look at the top three cards. Land go to all lands go to hand, and they reveal. Correct. That's what it says. Yep. Reveal all. Mm -hmm. So we have a Balakut Forest, uh, Colophian Forest, aka Mountain, and then a Minskin Boo. Minskin Boo and the uh, Balakut go to graveyard because that's technically. I don't think that's technically a land. I think it's just a modal. Uh, so this goes to the hand. Lost a life. Off no, it goes to the graveyard. Yeah. 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 Hey, 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 yeah. Um, and oh, then we will play a lotus petal. Pass on oh. lotus petal. Yep, pass on lotus petal. I will then pass turn. End of turn. I'm gonna activate. All right. Are we sack? Yep. No, no, we won't. Okay. Okay. Untap, upkeep, draw. Discord down. I will forgot to do that. I'll do that right now. <laughs> I'm just sitting here, just just chilling. I'm just chilling, guys. I'm not thinking about anything else. No thoughts in brain. Just chilling. Uh, so that is down to eight. One more. Eight. Or seven. Yes. What did you sack with Goblin Engineer? Question, Chad. Nothing. No. Oh. And just for information, because I know you have a breach in hand. I don't have a reach in hand. I can promise you there. I don't have reach in hand. All right. I just don't. I wouldn't have enough to flash back Savine's reclamation. So putting breach in Savine's in my graveyard is pointless because I only have four mana. Risky, risky, risky. Underworld breach. Pass on underworld hmm. breach. Pass on underworld breach. I pass.
Three us from our shackles. Oh, you lose one life. And our agony. Okay, you do lose one. You do lose do one. It. Mm -hmm. Do it. Do it. Gain a red mana off of Fergie. We're going to escape Cursed Mirror. And. Mm -hmm. Do you want to pop his breach in response, Sir Trekkie? I was, I was gonna, I was waiting for priority. But yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah. I'm passing <laughs> yeah, priority was, on this. I yeah, waiting, I was waiting for that. I'm passing priority as well. I'll crack the lotus to destroy cinder vines targeting underworld breach. You take two damage. While well, if it goes through, we all take two, or uh, he does. The, the controller takes two. Got you. And Goodbye, me. Don't go to the graveyard. Curse mirror. Pass some curse mirror. Yep. What did you make it come become a copy of? Out of curiosity. He's he's choosing. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. gotcha. I'm gonna have it enter the battlefield as a dog side extortion. That's hot as fuck, bro. Keep on keeping on. Pretty good. I got one. Account, uh, you got two, so you have eight. One so, eight. eight. Like, yep, two, put that to seven. I'm going to recast nor in the wary. That's good. I'll yep. generate a red mana off of her. Yes, sir. I'll use the red mana to skull clamp north. Sounds good. Draw two cards. That's good. Draw two cards. Oh, sorry. Big thing, big thing. Big Take your time, take your time. No rush, no rush, no rush. <laughs> big yeah. turns, big turns. I like it. Because I'm thinking he could just cast Norn a couple more times and keep, like, what's it called? Draw more cards and put something yeah. together if he wants to. Mm -hmm. Which is not actually a bad play since we're all tapped out. This is a window, like, technically speaking. Got in hand over there? Three. Nice. Just curious. Didn't remember. I'm gonna go down to four. Okay. okay. I'm gonna cast a heat shimmer. Pass on heat shimmer. Do it. Do it. Yeah. Oh, what's it targeting, technically? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna target Trekkie's dock side. All right. Do it, cast it, do it. You want to kill blind. your own oh, dock side and respect? Yeah, I'll, that's, that's what I was doing. I'll respond with a land throw at dock side. All right. It'll, it'll fizzle. Oh, I thought that was a druid cast to mage. No, 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 no. Six, I'll spend eight, five eight. for the worst fucking card you've ever seen in your life. Won't your dock side oh. kill Trekkie? Confusion in the ring. Yeah, yeah, it's dead. Sorry. Thank you. Okay. What is that card? <laughs> Sorry. Confusion in the ranks. What is that? Yeah, Whenever an artifact right. creature or an enchantment comes to play, its controller chooses target permit another player controls that shares a type with it. Exchange control. Confusion. Oh, fuck. Confusion of the what? Confusion in the rank. 
Oh, okay, yeah. Whenever an artifact creature or cre uh, enchantment enters a bad play, its charter chooses target permanent another player controls that play that shares a type with it. Exchange control with those permanents. So oh, that's cool. He's gonna take my uh, commander when he gets when he flips his commander over or casts it. Oh. Doing that sort of shenanigans. Oh, and he's just permanent. Yeah, that's hot. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use my red floating. Yep. I'm gonna equip skull plant to my docks. I'm gonna go, go to combat and I'm gonna swing it. Zero, Marvin. <laughs> zero. Wait, zero. Zero Wait, one coming at you. Absolutely. He wants it. I think I take zero. <laughs> Alrighty, before combat damage. Mm -hmm. I'll pass forever. Yeah, <laughs> no block. <laughs> <laughs> Some bonk is coming. Uh, I will <laughs> pass the turn. Okay. I will right. untap. Upkeep. This confusion in the ranks is actually a really cool card. I'm like, oh my. Right. It's a really cool card. And what's in your graveyard right now, uh, Chad? Everything. <laughs> <laughs> I just know you got a Shimmer, Goblin Engineer. Shimmer, Breach, Mind Stone, LED, Curio, Lotus Petal, all sorts oh. of stuff. What I mean, what artifacts notably that can get back with Engineer? Mind Stone, Lion's Eye Diamond, Lotus Petal. Yeah. Okay. And Honor Worn Shaku. All right. I'm just, I'm just going to... Uh... Upkeep and I'll draw for turn. Play a land. Draw, draw a card. Um, let's go. This is interesting. <laughs> this game got so much. <laughs> so much going on. Well, true. <laughs> but on the wrong side of the board, man. <laughs> How does Mox Diamond interact with the confusion of the, the what's it called things? The confusion in the ranks. There are two triggers. You are the active player. The discard of no. land no, no. gets... See, no, no, so that's not no, a trigger. No. That's a that's uh that's as it's in, like if what it, it's a replacement effect. Yeah. It's not a trigger. So that's my thing. Like Okay, it's gonna hit the graveyard if you don't uh, Yeah, it would there would it would never trigger the confusion of the ranks, right? If I don't discard it, if I don't have a land to discard to it, it just would never go to the grave. Because if uh if is a exchanging um, control requires both of them to be valid targets or okay. items as it resolves okay they only okay, exchange yeah. if both of them are on the battlefield when the trigger resolves no trigger got you got you got you got you got you if you don't discard a land it just goes straight to your graveyard but got yep. you i hear you okay all right well uh <laughs> i'm just gonna keep on keeping on i have to uh pass the turn oh boy <laughs> i'm to Upkeep. No upkeep triggers. Draw for turn. Let's see. That's funny. Hmm. Well, I am passing my turn. That's hot. Excellent. Keep on. Keep it on. Untap. Take four. Upkeep. That was that. Draw. Oh, well, here's the curious. Never mind. Go for it. No, I was going to. It's, it's not. It's irrelevant because Chad's commander was not in the command zone. I mean, wasn't on the battlefield. I forgot. Yeah, so I, I thought some switch was supposed to happen, but it was like he, he ne it never flickered back in because he wasn't on board. But keep going. Oh. Yeah, I'm curious about this. This enchantment's uh, definitely freezing some of the pace going on here. Sadly. 
fucking see you right there. I finally topped that to land. That's not the end of the world. Nice. <laughs> the second one uh, would be nice, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. We are going to do. Oh, did that work? No. Dang, that's such a weird card. I've, I've never had to think about my thing is anything I cast goes to somebody else. That's so weird. <laughs> That's that's mind breaking a little bit here. This but. is CEDH, bro. Yeah, it's, it's, I love it. <laughs> I love it. Oh I'm man! Right, if you all are it. watching right now, we have confusion in the ranks. <laughs> a mono red staple that's um coming to your near LGS. To, coming to an LGS near that's you. That's historical, dude. I love it. Oh man! Which you still get that's the ETB weird... though? No, it's like whenever it yeah, comes into play, you it. no 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 no. Mark, like, if Marvin were to cast a Thassus, he still would get the ETB. It's just the con he yes. wouldn't have control of Thassus anymore. Yes. yes. Yeah, he would still get the ETB, though. Whatever ETB creatures still do the ETB shit, shenanigans and stuff. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. All right, how about that? Cast a Gilded. <laughs> <laughs> how would that fucking That's work? A good double swing. It's a it double wouldn't. Swap. No, oh because yeah, God. it wouldn't work because uh, the yeah, original three, three, controller five, never. What are you talking about? Yeah, it would never work because the original controller never swapped with it. So it would just fucking sack. But then, oh, no, no, but the new controller can't sack it because it's attack that sack trigger is attached to the original person, not to the creature, to the original player. So it, you would just have a Gilded Drake. Whoever he switched we would just have a Gilded Drake on board then. Which is a nice thing. I take that. Oh, fuck yes, bro. <laughs> it's my turn, right? Uh, no, it's, it's, it's oh. Trek I'm playing play land. I'm playing land on Ultra Be Forced to Draw. Uh, then we'll, yeah, I'm sorry, this is lots of decisions happening here. Yeah, keep on going. I don't bro. like, I don't like any of these decisions, but we'll see what happens. Uh, yeah, we'll go straight to combat. Um, uh, gonna, I'll take, I'll, I'll spread the love a little bit. Uh, Marvin, take, uh, boar attack coming at you. That's sure. I mean, seven, right? Yep, yep that's just seven. Oh, wait, I'm not losing. Yep. All right. Uh, reveal top three. Um, we got two lands and a, and a braid. It's kind of hot. Braid goes to graveyard. Two lands go to hand. And then we are going to. Uh, how much? How much uh, toughness does Brigby have? Three. Her name, is, her name is three. Okay. What? What's happening? What? I'm sorry. I'm just asking how much the the health of that guy is. The Brigby. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Um, and then we'll do a. I don't like this at all, but let's see what happens here. Uh, we're going to do bro. a. Yeah, well, first, Soul Ring, look at top cards, top three. Mm -hmm. um... Yeah, we're doing that. Order it this way. Uh, we're gonna then crack soul ring. Uh, soul ring. One ring. Cheese. The other thing. For, for a five draw. <laughs> Keep on going, bro. Three, four, five. Alrighty. We are then going to cast a lot of stuff here. Thank you. Should say you pass. I'm no, going he's saying cast, cast a lot of stuff. Cast. I'm going to cast cast. a lot of I stuff. I was like, like, what? Wait, what? <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we'll do. Uh, color is still a problem. That's fine. I'll just deal with it. Uh, one green, and we'll do two red for Azusa Lost But Seeking, but it's going to switch targets. This is the experiment a little bit here. To help me learn how this works. So I'm gonna pick a new thing to get, correct? Yeah, I'm gonna pass on the cast. Right. Yeah. Go ahead. I'm passing. I'm gonna pass. Alright. Uh we're gonna swap things, yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh I will take your Brigby. Bergy. Bergy, thank you. I can no, I take the Zeus. Alright. Okay. That's your next one. <laughs> <That is, laughs> okay. Is I'm surprised. I'm gonna be honest. I'm surprised you don't just fucking destroy the confusion of the ranks. Uh, what's it called? Um, With the card that what? I used to get rid of breach. That one? No, no. I'm saying as in like you're in green. I would thought. I thought green had a lot of artifact in the chamber. But I thought you had I, it this turn. Like I force a vigor. Grip, but I'm not drawing. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking. I was thinking like, fuck. He's just gonna fucking I, force a vigor that bitch. Yeah. Uh, 
we'll do a we'll throw one land, a city of brass at mages. We're gonna we're gonna stop this a little bit here. Sure. All right. Um, in response, I'll float a red. All right. Sounds good. Yeah. Great. Now that I have access to green again, I am going to cast a, a little funny card. One green. Uh, nope. Let's do command tower for that green. For a Korean Ranger, I'm going to get back my In response to the Korean Ranger. Yeah, go ahead. Crack, crack those two lands and then draw two cards, question mark. Whoa! Do not draw. Pitch. This is on, this is on uh, foot, not on a uh, Ah, okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. But you can still fetch, yeah. You can, you can still fetch, of course. Fetch, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go fetch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah woohoo! I'm, I'm ending the train traces. here. <laughs> I'm ending the train here because I, I need access to green. Uh, okay, so, yeah. We'll... UT and... Um, um, wait, underground C and the banner, I guess. Wait a sec. Let me just check real yeah, quick. So, we're, we're good over there, uh, chat with Ayatsu Zabak. You have mm -hmm. Ranger mm -hmm. and I have... Uh, have your card, which I'll get a token out in a second here. Which is Wait, so it went Azusa for Bergy. Yep, for Bergy. Kyrian Bergy. That's for for Azusa. Azusa. And now yep. Sir Trick has and Bergy that, and Azusa. Yep. Yep. Okay, so exactly now I have a Quarian Ranger. Okay. Yep. I was waiting for the, the land stuff to pass and then I can move on. Yeah. I'm playing shift playing switcheroo over here and it's real weird yeah no go bananas bro i'm trying uh i could get a tundra as well right uh, <laughs> just wait for marvin to be ready <laughs> i guess yeah i'm like very blind at this point because obviously i can't find my land <laughs> i got the uc at least it's which is something yeah. right so mm -hmm. ah there it is tundra let me know when you're good and then I'm good on passing on. All right, Green Ranger. Green Ranger, yeah. Sounds great. Uh, then we got next thing I gotta do. More shuffling here. Okay. Um, it's just so weird. We'll do a. What's the right order for this? I think it's this. Um, we will do a uh, Bird of Paradise for one green. Okay. I'm gonna take your goblin engineer. Like a bird. Oh, actually, you know what? I'll respond to that. Okay. I'll I also get my away. engineer for a sweet, sweet activation. Is that cool? Yeah. What you talking, yeah. brother? I'll put a lotus petal onto the field. Yeah, mm -hmm. you're good, bro. And you use I'll that. I'll take right your up. one ring. Oh. I'll take the one ring. Okay. Yeah. Go for it. You have a tap one ring. I have a lotus petal. Um, yeah. this is so weird. Oh man. Mm -hmm. So I have you, that's over there, and your thing is tapped. We're just doing shuffling now at this point. It's okay. We'll then play uh one one land force to draw. Mm -hmm. Well, that's your additional land drop for the turns. Yeah, got you. I have to I get two additionals. Two additional. Got you, got you, mm -hmm. got you. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's my that's my second land for turn. And then we'll do... I think this is a good one to do here because... I like cast another spell, so it's got another mana for the bird. Um, and then we will do a... I still have a Lotus too I can crack. Okay. Just trying to get all the pieces in together here. Mm -hmm. I will crack the Lotus and a green for Ren and mm -hmm. Six, but there are no other targets of Planeswalkers on the board, correct? No, Planeswalkers is not, not an option. It's not an option. That's not on the options either. Okay, yeah. great. That's fine with me. Uh, so Ren and Six is going to enter. Anybody? No. Do anything? Nope, you're good. Nope. Three mana now on, on that. Uh, we got. What's giving? Oh yeah, the Bergy mana. Got you, got you, got you. Bergy mana, pretty good. I hate this, but you know, do 
you got to do. Oh. So dumb. I love it. We'll, you, we'll uptick him to go get a land. So we're going to be at four. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Get Aaron Mesa. Mm -hmm. That back in hand. Mm -hmm. And we will. It'll be interesting. What other, creature, what other creatures do you control over there? I control on, ch on your creatures. Board. Only yeah, your creatures. Just, I think a Kyrian Ranger is the only one left on his yeah. board. Kyrian and, and Bird. And Bird. BOP. Bird of Paradise. Um, we'll then do... This turn is just so wonky. I hate it. Just want to say that out loud. I really, really hate this. Uh, we'll do... <laughs> a... Beast Whisper with using uh, it's on cast, right? For this. So I have to mm -hmm. use two mana. And then the green to cast Beast Whisper. And I go back up to three from that. Would you which like then control of? I'm gonna get control of my uh Korean Ranger. Okay. And then and you, you get have a beast, beast whisper. Again. Yeah, so I'm, power I'm and trying to get that. Uh power and toughness is two three. Okay, keep on and going. And lastly, the, yeah, I know, I'm trying. The last thing I get to do is we'll play my third land for turn, a forest. Forest to draw a card. And I will crack miss the rainforest to go get a land. Be another forest. Perfect. Right on the bottom, so I didn't have to even look that far. <laughs> and I'll be casting a Lotus Cobra. Okay, that sounds yeah, like there's a you combo You should have now. started with the Cobra. Yeah, but also it's a lot of passing back and forth. I didn't know if I would get everything out in time. Hmm. Also, just a buzz everything. So, give you Lotus Cobra. I get back Beast Whisperer. Okay. You just tap the two mana. Mm -hmm. I'm at four red mana. Okay. And we will do, lastly... Uh, look at top three with dividing top. Oh gosh. Okay. I will then tap this to swap it with my top card. Okay. There's a lot of shuffling here, and I apologize. You good, man? You don't have to apologize. You're Your deck is doing what it do. It's okay. It's interesting. It's trying. To, it's trying the best to get there, but yeah. it's the shuffling that would have that broke me. No, no, <laughs> it's yeah, like, it's a real, that's a really interesting card. I'm very perplexed right now. My soul now. is broken. Yeah, no, this is, this is very interesting. You're doing well yeah, navigating it to, like, get your creatures on board that you want. I'm trying to get enough of them on the board here. Yeah. Uh, and then we'll do a do last one, which is kind of a weird one. Uh, Volokut Exploration. It's a landfall thing. I know I would have done it earlier, but... Okay, you'll I have drew, a confusion. I I'll have a valid. Yep. Okay. I now have confusion. That will be. Um, I get to my exile. Valakut Exploration? Yes, it's on landfall. You get to exile top card of your library and play it that during that turn at your end step. If it doesn't get played, you put it into your, the owner's graveyard and then deal damage equal to the number of cards, basically. That you each card. Yeah, but, yeah, okay. Each card. Weird you stuff here, You but... got a way to take that one ring back because you just gave him a landfall trigger thing and with the one ring on the board. I don't have any artifacts in hand. That's oh. what I was drawing for. I was you know what's super crazy, guys? Mm. The confusion in the ranks yeah. plus Sensei's dividing top is a really yeah. fun interaction. Lord. And I was hoping that I could have ordered it better to do that, but I did not. So I did not get to draw back my dividing top. Mm. Realized that I was trying to get enough things to play to do that, but should have just okay. done that first and drew the draw. So the last mana fizzles, and yep, you have an untapped. Take five damage from one ring. <laughs> did you, you take your upkeep damage? I did this turn, yes. Okay. I was at 34 and I went down again. I might have Already? missed the trigger. Am I good to go to my turn? Did. Yeah, yeah. yeah. effects. You're good. Oh boy. I apologize for that shenanigans. We'll deal with it. 
these things up so people can see what's going on. Big five. I'll draw six. All right, upped it to six and drew it. Yeah. What up, High Ground Gaming? This is it's a good game interesting. So yeah, that's very but perplexing. Like, but this is yeah. wacky. It's real wacky. At least you guys got colors back. You're welcome. Yeah. Well, I appreciate <laughs> that, my good sir. Yeah. Are you guys good if I get a cup of coffee real quick? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, do your thing. Please, please do. Do it, thing. the difference uh thunder with my old deck style is that i would have been like you guys i would have been stuck mm -hmm. this deck draws and actually does something outside of the combo <laughs> so, right 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 that's that's the main difference of why i like this the rework with six because six is i need some basics to make it run with the yeah combos. i'm gonna skull clamp the bird yeah that's good. all right goes to your graveyard. Uh, you, goes to my graveyard i'll draw two sounds good Play a land yet? Nope. If you're after, just just hop on the track. That's all. Let's see. This is really perplexing. I like this interaction. That that enchantment is just. Yeah, this smile. is really fun. Like it's wacky. It's fun. It's kind of like just I'm looking like oh my. It's making me really focus on like on all the possibilities. Like I love thinking like this. This is fucking dope. Well, that's been funnier. Uh, high grind, high grind, of, high grind of, gaming. Oh. Yeah, yes, looks like it's been a good game so far. It has been a very good game right now. The notable card on the battlefield that's throwing everyone for a loop is a confusion in the ranks currently under control under Sir Trek. But uh, Chad Cassid, it, it says whenever an artifact, creature, or enchantment comes into play, its controller choose. Uh, chooses target permanent another player controls that shares a type with that uh, with it exchange control of those permanents so that basically no one can and like you have to unless you have we have a way to destroy it all we're doing is playing you know shuffle roulette, <laughs> shuffle roulette basically to see oh i'll take this but then you take this kind of thing so i get out my they start writing down what these cards are yeah <laughs> so it's really really interesting It really is a land draw. I'm going to play a Dragon's Rage champ. Yeah, it does. <laughs> High ground is like, seems like a tough one on the line. Yeah, it, it is a little tough. No, we, uh, Sir has been uh, navigating pretty well, and Sir and Chad, because they've been the main one thus far. I'll get my birdie back. That's with it. Yeah, pa right. uh, pass on the DRC. Right. Uh, sir, what, has what does that other one do? Dragon Rage Dragon. Um, every time you cast a non creature spell, you surveil perfect. one. And then okay. it has Delirium if you have four types of things, which makes it have plus two, plus two, making it a 3 3 total. And it has attack every combat if able to. Right. I'm going to play a Ruby Medallion. Okay. I'll generate. Did I go to one sweet, sweet red Pass on Ruby Medallion. What you switch one? I'm gonna exchange it for the the helm. The helm, okay. Helm. Okay. I'm going to play a mana crit. I'll generate a red with Bergy. Okay. In response, yeah. I'll tap it, Not and I will get my Ruby Medallion. Okay. okay. So you have a tapped mana grip now, sir. Yep. We have two colorless, two red. 
What's the crow that you swapped out for me? Helm. He has Mana your helm. Crypt. Where's yeah. helm? The my helm. Bl of... My blind. The thing that's horn? making us draw, like horn. the uh, yes, horn, horn of greed. Horn. horn of greed. That's what. That's what I was confused. Yeah, I was like, yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, where's helm? I don't know. I see helm of the house. Yeah. Okay, I gotta tap mana crypt. Hmm. hmm. Very interesting. I don't know what to do. Hmm. I'm sorry for taking so long. Are uh, you good, bro? Uh, turn to these cast a Ruby Medallion and a uh, Mana Crypt. Two colors flowing, two Berkey Red crypt. Mana floating. Yeah, yeah. I'll pass on both of them. <laughs> Not that it matters, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is a very interesting board state. And it's a weird game. I'm going to cast a Mog Salvage on Soul Reef. I'm going to discard a land to destroy your bird. Your... I think it's generating red mana. I've never seen the name right. Yeah. Pass on the uh, Borborygmos trigger. Activation. Activation, yeah. Targeting what again? Um, the Bergy. The Bergy. Bergy. <laughs> Cards in hand, Trekkie. Oh. Six. Uh, we got seven after the discard. Mm. How do you have a seventh card from the? How you discard? Right. I will discard a Court of the Calling, which I'm not going to use because it's just going to keep shuffling stuff around. Right. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it was the last card in my hand. Thank you for. No, you good. You I, good. Yeah. I think I drew one right at the end, and I just didn't remember that I was like, I'm at seven. Oh yeah, it was the uh, divining top. That's what screwed me. Got you. Like, got I have you. Seven, got you. And I did that. So. Yeah, that's fine by me. Okay. okay Bergy dies. Three Bergy man in the air. Mock salvage targeting soul ring. Uh, your uh, Lotus Petal Ball is in your graveyard. I used that earlier. Okay. And uh, what about the Soul Ring? Are we good on my? I'm passing on Mog Salvage. I'm passing on Mog Salvage. Is that me? Tap Soul Ring, right? So, yeah, that goes to go. the graveyard. No, he's destroying it. All right. Going graveyard. I was just making sure that was the right thing to do. No, you good. You good. It's a lot of things. Just tell me what the right thing to do is sometimes. <laughs> I'll make mm. sure it gets done. I'm going to play a Goblin Weld. Okay. Pass some Goblin shop. Welder. Goblin right. Welder. Yep. I'll take the Azusa. Okay. Um, in response, I will discard a land to kill the Azusa. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, let's see how much more you've got sure i'll show you a deflecting swat up hmm pass on deflecting swat deflecting swat what are you targeting the the ability it's on the stack resolve. yeah he's it's targeting the ability on the stack, stack. He doesn't have to target the new target yet no right, that's so a resolution to something else yeah awesome sounds good uh I'm I'll passing on the Fletting Swat. I'll hit okay. the Beast Whisperer. Okay. Beast Whisperer uh, dead. Then we have the exchange. Do I have an for... Azusa? Yeah, you do. And I have a Goblin Loader. Yeah. I do have it. Hmm. 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 I have an Azusa somewhere. I don't know, man. I'm not sure either. I was waiting for something now. It's just a weird one, man, but I love it. You guys were just about and the I have a Lotus Cobra. Let's see. <laughs> yep. And you're forced to draw every time that you play land. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll have one colorless foot. Okay. I'm sorry, I'll have two colorless foot. What, what math are you doing right now? I, I forgot about Ruby Medallion. Got you, got you. Two colorless floating. I'm spending one colorless, my last red, for a Wheel of Misfortune. Okay. Have some Wheel of Misfortune. I'd like to tap this one for white in response. Wait, am I? Let me think here for a second. Hmm. You don't have to discard. I don't have to, but maybe I want to. <laughs> I have to think of a second. Ah! <laughs> sure. I'll 
accept this one for the right to cast Enlightened Tutor in response. I'll pass on the Enlightened Tutor. That's on it. What you getting, brother? Since there's a lot of like uh, drawing related stuff going on, <laughs> I'll, guess I'll get a small ring type maybe. Oh, mm. that makes sense with the one ring mm. shenanigans, yeah. Okay. And it notes get even weirder every time you find a treasure, you're gonna get control of a different. Oh, artifact. wait, I have to thank you because they're like, I'd... how many enchantments are on the field right now? I think there's only two enchantments. Two, yeah, at the moment. Wait, because I, I, I just thought about the confusion of the ranks again. Mm hmm. Mm. <laughs> yeah. You We're wanna... all getting oh. weird up in here. Get a. So you get end a... up giving somebody else a get smother. A, and get a turd artifact. And take the yeah. one ring. And then you'll have no, a one ring. Shit. Nah, fuck this shit, man. This is all, the only thing I'm, is, I'm, though, I'm, if you... I'm not, getting, I'm not getting value stuff, because, like, this, I'll just get... I'm, I don't know the draws, but maybe I'll draw, like, good, so I'll get this free configuration on top. Okay. Who knows, right? All right. Uh, okay. Priority's back on chat for the Wheel of Misfortune. I'm passing. All right. I'm I'll uh, tap one white, and I'll attempt to cast my own Enlightened oh, Tutor. While it's on the stack, I'm going to throw another land at Azusa. Sure. Goes to your graveyard. Yes, it does. All right. Might as well use that land. Five in hand or four in hand? I'm now at four. Wait, so then then there's okay. I got it. Then I have an enlightened tutor. Mm -hmm. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Get it. I will go search. For a underworld breach that I can actually use, so. So you're gonna give it to somebody else. You don't have to. Just saying. I don't, but it's like <laughs> in the in the world that you know I get rid. Like I'm 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 on hope and prayers and dreams right now. I'm not. <laughs> like we, I guess I, I'm like I said. Like I told you I didn't have breach in hand. Like I like I'm in hope and yeah, prayers and dreams yeah. right now. So like, right now I'm I'm on top decks. Like I'm old town to three. The fact that the game is still going at this point, I'm like, all right, and your fuck dreams it. Might be coming true, right? Right. No, nah, I mean, I'm just like I'm just like let's see what the fuck happens. Like maybe I draw some like real like you know grade A like fire. I don't know. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. I'll put that on top, and then I'm gonna pass on uh, Wheel of Misfortune when it gets back to T. Okay. Let's choose our numbers. Okay. I have, his, I have a little whiteboard. I'm gonna write down. Oh, yeah. I, I'm, I'll take my phone then. One sec. Oh, because I didn't. Let's see. Sure. Ready to reveal? Three, two, one. Hey, are you ready? Yep. Watch out. Okay. Let's go. Oh, no. I have a 10. 15. 7. Ah, I'm the lowest. I don't go anywhere. All right. Take so 15. you'll take 15, and me and uh, Marvin will. We are just discarding, right? So yeah. I'll discard. Orchestra Master. I don't take anything correct because I'm the lowest. Yes. Yeah. I just don't. You're discarding a bowmaster. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm discarding yeah, front a box diamond, I'm, I'm, a I'm, I'm, final I'm fortune, and a wind swept heath. And I really Pyroblast, to Karn, Sting Skirt. Uh, bowmaster. Cobra trigger, I'll add a red to my mana pool, and I'll draw a card. Okay. And then I'll exile the top card of my for Val Explorate. Yep. That is true.
one and a colorless or one red and a colorless i'm gonna cast jessica's will uh we all have seven hand i have to pass one uh you can target whoever you or me or marvin who you want to target bro Oh, yeah. oh, what mode, mode are you doing? Because your commander's not out, is it? I'm going for mana. Okay, yeah. So, me or Marvin, either or. Yeah, I got seven in hand. Who you want to target? I'll target you, T. Yep. No effects. I'll pass on Jessica's will. Same here. Yeah. I'll use a colorless. I'm going to skull clamp the lotus card. No effects. I'll draw two. No, I just have the horn and pelican. Hmm. Hmm. The fourth time you cast it? Question mark. This is the third. Oh, okay. In response, cost me five. In response, I will trigger Green Ranger to return a uh, force to my hand. Sure. And what does that do? Oh, keep going. You know you can't. I also it. untap a target. I also untap a target creature as well. Oh, got you, got you. Oh, got you. Uh, yeah, keep going. Four. Okay. Uh, Nord enters the battlefield. Yep. Um, sure. I will exchange control of Norin and Orbrigus. That's on ETB, correct? Or is that before ETB? That's on ETB. ETB confusion of the ring. Great. Yeah. So this, this is a dumb question. If I shoot your commander, does the switch still go off? No, because no, exchange has to I, happen through things happening. You still have lands in your hand. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I just so got it back. Put, he just put it into his hand. Yeah. Just, yeah. 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 I, was, I was like, if you're in a target board, I got it. If you don't, we're, we're, we're chilling. So there we go. I did that. I showed. I did it with Ranger. Like, like, come on, man! Don't pick the bar. Don't do it. <laughs> you know what's coming. Play a sword. Okay. Pass on sword. Yep. Uh, I'm gonna tap it first. Two colorless. Right. Yep. Yep. Um, I'll ch exchange control with the talisman. Uh, my talisman? Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, just in response, I will float a... Oh, it actually does not matter. I will uh, pay and just... Uh, there's a little red most of wars. I guess life total doesn't matter. I'll float a colorless off of it. Sure. Two colorless. So I, have soul. I have a tap soul ring. That is correct. All right. Two and one. I'm going to cast a treasonous ogre. Pass on treasonous ogre. Pass on treasonous ogre. I will take a Borborygmos. I have no effects right. on that. Go for it. This Borborygmos is like. Like, never, I've never seen people like so eager to like try Take it, yeah. <laughs> Take it, yeah. 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 But he, like, very powerful. Like, yeah. 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 This game, like for an hour, it's more than more like Chad versus Tricky. No, to be completely <laughs> honest, I don't. Th I think my only spells I've cast this turn was yeah. Pact to you offer it to make a treasure. So early. Yeah. You guys get locked out so early. Nah, it wasn't we got locked out, or we just didn't do anything to be fully transparent. 
Well, you didn't have any. You didn't only had red mana. Like, no, uh, like that was on turn know. three or four. You know what I'm saying? We weren't. Oh, yeah. I was on. Right. That's what I'm saying. It wasn't. We were locked out early. Right, just we right. weren't doing anything. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. Like, After yeah. the early, that that that's right. We were locked out in the <laughs> yeah. game of CTH. <laughs> yeah. Um, What's up, Lenora? Uh, Lenora, Paradise. How you what feeling? Like do? What up? Have a red. We got a lightning bolt, tricky. In the face. Ooh, how nice of you. There you go, 26. This board state is impeccable. I'm gonna right evoke now. fury pitching peripherals. Pass on evoked fury pitching peripherals. Yeah, Same. All right. Um, I control the triggers, so I'll have it die before confusion the ranks trigger. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to sweep the welder, okay. the channeler, and the range. All right. Uh, I will activate welder. I'm trying to figure out how this card works. Welder has it summoning not have haste. It is summoning sickness. I have haste. You're correct. And the minute you exchange something, you have to untap with it for it to have haste. So none of this yep. could, right now, like the Boba yep. can't That's attack fair. this turn because it doesn't have haste. Even though he got control of my board, yes, like, because that's the reason. Like Act of Treason says, gain control and you get, and give it haste. Ah. You know what I'm saying? Like in, when you there change you control or something, that that's what it does. So you said you killed Welder and what else? Sorry, I, I was in the midst of other things. We're in Ranger. Yep. Welder, Dragon's Rage yep. Channeler. Okay. So the dragon thing. Well, the dragon range trailer is a three three because he's he's definitely oh. you know, delirium. Delirium. All right, so I'll do three. two so two renin sticks. Okay. So definitely dead still, yeah. No, DRC still alive because it's technically yeah, a three DRC. three. Oh, I'm sorry, no. Yeah, it's a three three because of delirium. But your renin sticks is technically two. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. No, no problem. Okay, I'd like to go to combat with my sweet, sweet Borborygmos. I have no effects. I have no effects as well. Swinging. You can't attack, attack. We just got done saying Borborygmos. Oh, well, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you can't attack because you didn't untap with it. That's why the cards like Act of Treason say. No, 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 no. It no longer has summoning sickness. What it's it been on the haste. battlefield forever. No, it never no, no, left no, no, no. The no. That, that's not how it works. So if you look up the card Act of Treason. It says gain control of something and give it haste. The reason it says that is because you have the act of attacking ha is only done through untapping with the creature. That's what allows you to remove summoning sickness, not the act of gaining control of it when it already didn't have summoning, summoning sickness. I promise you that's how it works, but I don't mind you all looking this up. I have to I have to look it up as well because I have no clue. <laughs> yeah, I, I know this one because like that's the reason Gilded Drake, you can't Gilded Drake take somebody's with Gilded Drake and give haste. And that's why like that's the reason why active treason has haste. So if you look up Makes sense. Yeah, if you look up All what right, yeah. removes summoning sickness. Let's look good because I gotta look this up in focus. Gotcha. No no, you're hundred percent right. Yeah. So I'm gonna, yeah, I'm, I'm just saying this for the folks when we uh for the stream. So yep. for the people, how this works is summoning sickness is a term used to describe a creature that has just been played on the battlefield because that it can't attack or uh, use a tap ability. Summoning sickness ends at the start of this controller's next turn. Haste and flash are the best ways to mitigate this effect of summoning sickness. So for those who are interested in playing this spicy as confusion in the ranks, <laughs> make sure you don't have like tap shenanigans you're trying to do. Okay, so I still have two red floating. Um, so you're not going to I'm combat? Gonna... No. Okay. Shatter Skull smashing X equals one, discounted by Ruby Medallion. I'll deal one damage to Ren and Six. All right. Bonk. Down to one. I don't want you to big dice because that's just it's a little Yeah, fun. one damage to the target and turn up to one down. Yeah. Okay. And that is Pretty my good. turn. All right, on the end step, I need to do a board chart because I actually, uh, this is for me and for the people. We are going to do the good old, what's actually on the board state check. Sure. 
Yep. Mm -hmm. And so how this will work is, can we just start after me, Marvin? Can you just list off what's on your board? Because we have, <laughs> we have so uh, much happening. Yeah, so much. confusion in the ranks has been on the board. Stuff is getting coming left. So uh, first, starting off with Marvin, what you got on your board, brother? Yeah. I got a Chrome Mox, a Thrasios, UC, Gemstone, Atavara, and Tep Tundra. Sounds good. And then next we have uh, Sir Trekkie. Um, there's been a, what, what happened with that uh, Treasonous Ogre? Did you give it to Sir Trekkie? Oh, yes. I still have that. You You're have right. a Treasonous Ogre, yes. You have a Treasonous Ogre it. and a Goblin Engineer. Yes. And a uh, Goblin is, Engineer, I thought you killed that, but I I thought the Dragon Channel was still around too. The dr I did. I did. I'm you sorry. did. So the engineer should be in the graveyard. There we go. Engineer yep. and welder are dead. Treason right. Elgar. And chat. Somebody's your got my dead. mana crypt. Yeah, and you my chat. Your screen I, is frozen right now because you refresh. You need quick, to refresh. Bro. You need to. Refresh. I need to refresh. Oh, okay. Cool. 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 Yeah. Cool. Yeah. It's just you. All right. Bad. 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 See, okay, people. So, y'all saw my screen. Y'all saw my hand moving still, right? <laughs> the people saw me moving. They, it's everybody we saw else. You move. TPCs we saw you, now. We saw you moving. All right. Uh, so we got. Uh, Hold on. I'm almost back. I got to fix my aspect ratio. Hold on. It's not working. You're good. You're good. Yeah. One second. It's not working. No. What's the uh, card damage on Treasonous again? I got a. Four, it's a two three, I think. Two, it's a two three. Yeah. Thank you. With pay three life, add red to your. I removed the effect. I just didn't remember the. Hold on. <laughs> I, do y'all ever get that glitch where you try to use a use the camera thing and it doesn't work because it'll like zoom you in super mm -hmm. deep? Yeah. You need to reset your aspect ratio. No, yeah, that's I've already done that. I'm talking about I'll reset the aspect ratio and it won't go truly to 16 by 9. Neither here nor there. Um, starting, oh yeah, we're on trekking now. So you have but a treasonous have ogre. Perfectly fine. Red and six, treasonous ogre, dragon channeler, I think is what this name is. Dragon rage. Uh, rage. Mana trick, dragon rage channeler. Yep. And uh, arcane signet and mana crypt. And I will. And what are those right things here. up top right there? These are all things on his board, which we, he can cover on his turn. That's what that's on his. Okay, he has a Bulgarigmos, he has a land thing, he has the the Valakut thing. The Valakut, which is the land. And the one ring on seven. And one ring on six. God damn. I wish I could fucking uh, was gonna take control of that and tap it. I don't run Manamo though, yay. Uh, and then your turn, Chad. What's in your board, bro? I have a Borborigmos, a Skull Clamp, a Ruby Medallion, and your Talisman. Okay. As All well right. as the one ring. I'll untap upkeep and I'll draw one. I will play a flooded strand and I get to draw one card, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Draw one. And then I'll crack the flooded strand. Before I start doing things and I'm not getting fucked by no stops. Uh can I fetch? I'm good with the fetch. All right. Yep. I'm going to go get a plateau. Plateau. <laughs> you got your plateau. So the only stacks piece though is that motherfucking switch roo thing, right? What's the other stacks piece? Yeah. The is draw. That that's that's it. Good. The draw technically okay. could be, but I don't think it is. Yeah. That that's a that was the opposite of stacks piece. It's a favorable piece. The group hug. Group hug. <laughs> it's group hug. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will. Then. That doesn't work. That doesn't work. I will attempt to float two colors using one colors, tap steam vents and plateau floating Ooh. colors, and I'll attempt to cast a three fairy. Bro, is that okay? Um. So wait. So what? Uh, like, let me think here for a second. So the two fairy is like kind of bad because you can play soaring. Wait, it's not. No, the soaring right? is not under my control. This is if I bounce the soul ring, it goes back to Chad's hand. Because so, this is not you, my soul ring. And also, even if you cast the breach, the breach will get exchanged, right? Exactly. Yep. For either Valakut or for the uh, switch room confusion. Man, everything can just like fishy. Fishy. Yep. What do we do here, guys? Oh, I, I can buy oh, this play. 
my. He, uh, oh, actually, if you cast that, you'll switch with Ren and Six. Nope. <laughs> I get control. Nope. Oh, because so... oh, I keep forgetting Confusion's not Planeswalker. My bad. Thank you. Mm, I keep thinking, you know, it's, I keep thinking it's everything, but it's almost Man. everything. Man, so he probably. He, 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 he gets stuff on his hand. Wait, I saw a kitten, right? Or am I tripping? No, I don't have kitten in my hand or nor in my graveyard. No, I can't oh, do kitten so combo. What is in your hand? I, what I, are your intentions with the I can't. Daughter? I can't do kitten combo because Soul Ring would go to Chad's hand, and he took yeah. away my talisman. And talisman doesn't work either way unless I have a kitten on board. I cannot do the kitten. Combo. Everything is like kind of bad, bro. That's why I like you. Yep. But I can't do shit here. So Jeffer is good, I guess. Very good. He's winning now. He's bad. All right. Teferi will enter in with four He's good for you, but colorless. Bad. I will down tick Teferi to one to mm. bounce the fuck up enchantment to hit, uh, Chad's hand. We got a normal turn, guys. That okay? Yeah. I'll draw one card. The ring stays with me. The, ring, stay, did, the right? ring stays with you, though. Yep. Oh, no, I'm bad at this game. I have a colorless still floating. Mm. I will... Ah, the Pac-Man Child is gone, right? You said what? The confusion? The confusion is gone? Yes, yes, the confusion is gone now. Oh, no, we did. We know about the breach, right? Mm-hmm. Sad life. I will then tap... One colorless and cast a grand abolisher. Awesome not to Chevy. To make it extra safe. But in response to the to the Grand Abolisher, I'd like to take your thrust, yes. Yeah. I could have done that before, right? Mm -hmm. Why are you tapping out, dog? Why shouldn't I? <laughs> Don't you have counter spells? No. Apparently but yeah, they would, they would have used it before the Grand Abolisher. Yeah, but I would have used it on the Grand Abolisher then. He's gonna get locked Is out. Grand anyways. Abolisher, okay? A value abolisher. Yeah. Abolisher comes down. I will use a colorless and crack this treasure to cast Underworld Breach. There it is. And I have and I have no Otavara. Yeah, you got I'm, it. Is Underworld Breach it. okay? Yes, yep. sir. What do you have in your hand, Marvin? Uh, I can reveal it. Abrupt decay. Which does nothing because of the fairy. Yeah. Mana Crypt, Tardis Citadel, Meme Betrayal, Flash Duplicate, and uh, Dumbly's Call, which would get, would get uh, the World Jewel yeah. actually. Uh, first configuration and the Blend Obedience now. Yeah. Alright. GG. Alright. I would like to walk through it. I've lost the life off of Man Confluence. I will cast this Lotus Petal. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. Yep. Crack it for three red commander mana. Does not matter. Right. Lotus Petal? Yeah. I'm uh, Jewel Lotus, my bad. Jewel Lotus. Um, my yeah. storm count is one, two, three. And then I will uh, go to the graveyard and cast this lion's eye diamond from my graveyard. Storm count going up to four. I will pitch two lands and a third uh, Jewel Lotus to cast LED. Is that okay? Oh shit! Yep. Yep. And Get you can it. brain freeze, and then yep. And then I'll Don't crack the these. Thing. I'll crack LED for three blue. Uh, discarding last chance, cursed mirror, windfall, Phyrexian metamorph, and Esper Sentinel. I'll use mm -hmm. go up to yeah, technically storm five, but it'll just include itself. I'll leave one blue floating to cast a brain freeze. Uh, storm four plus itself is fifteen. Pitching Esper Sentinel. Phyrexian Metamorph and uh, Mox Diamond yeah, to build myself 15. Is that okay? Oh, yeah. Alright. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And then I'll show the shit ton of cards in here. Yada, yada, yada. Um, I have no yeah. force. I have no force drawing. I, I have no force drawing engines on board. What I'd like to do is uh, present the loop of milling my oh, yeah. Millie, there's is there any force draw on board right now? Any 
everyone's completely tapped out, right? Only if you, only yeah, if you and, and you got you got friend of bonus shot and the parry, right? I yeah, you yeah, can't. No one can tap activate their right. features or anything. So what I'm gonna do yeah. is I actually do it. Uh, do the I never do it this way. I will. No, I'm just gonna. If y'all have it, you have it. I'm gonna mill myself out. Other than let's say, where's my deflecting spot? I'm gonna mill myself out, making a shit ton of mana in the process, leaving up a yeah. man enough mana to cats a deflecting spot hard cast out of my graveyard, and then I'm a thousand sure. oracle. You got it. Mona three <laughs> baby, <laughs> silent as fuck. <laughs> Just fucking <laughs> sat there and shut the fuck up, bro. I was it's like, funny if if Chad didn't play that switcheroo, I. I think I could have won all my turn. No, funny. <laughs> you know, like you want really to know easily. what the fucking funny right. thing is? If Chad didn't fucking play that switcheroo, I would have fucking won on my turn because I had fucking Enlightened Tutor in my uh, hand to go get fucking Underworld Breach and yep, I had just yep. enough to cast uh, Underworld Breach, bro. Fuck, bro, man. But you are, you are that switcheroo was crazy, bro. Yeah. The two non blue players were in a 1v1. Yeah, yep. for real. I was literally, like, I was like, bro. I was locked. Yeah, for real. I was like locked out. I was gonna draw so many lands, boys. Know. So many land draws with uh, intervention next okay. turn. So first of all, <laughs> starting starting with chat, how did that talk to me about that game? I want I wanted to ask first, how does your deck win? But even more, what was your thought process in your last couple, like well, last turn specifically? You talking to me uh starting with chat yeah. i'm gonna add yeah, go strike ahead, next because i think me and marvin yeah, really yeah. didn't do anything but i'll, I'll yeah. add marvin well unfortunately with confusion in the ranks it is a chaos like stacks piece right right and i had the unfortunate situation of having a boar berigmas across from me because i play a creature based combo mm. right shoot yes stuff. so, yeah. yep. so um, is that a nambo with your commander what do you mean a non-bo with my command? Like no, like confusion plus Norn equals I steal shit. Oh, I'm saying as in like, does that stop you from winning the game though? Question mark. Confusion of the ranks does if my underworld breach is gone. My underworld breach was gone. Oh, so you go you you go wheel of fortune into uh Jessica's wheel breach and then you loop yeah, it yeah, like yeah. that. You don't have to cast LED, so you can. But the question is, how would you land? Oh, with, how would you land? How would you land Underworld Breach with the Confucius on the battlefield? Like, how would you win if your Confucius is on the battlefield? My question. It's a good question. <laughs> it's more of a value piece. Okay. I do have a Despotic Scepter to get rid of my own permit. Which one, Despotic? Oh, the. Yeah. Destroy target permit. You will. Got oh, okay, all right, all right. And you had the engineer, which would eventually let you uh disrupting scepter or despite. So the question is oh. like, what does confusion of the ranks do? Stops it causes everybody from no, 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 like it. I, I saw what it does. My question was the uh, what how do you win through it? But with this, uh, with the despotic scepter, I can see how it wins. Question real quick, have did you ever think about running the uh that one uh that's not the sword you know it's three mana it's something where you pay a life one destroy your own permanent pay two life do this pay three life do that pay five life untap it it's similar to the other one what is this shit called it goes in the the regular one goes infinite with assault monolith or it goes it's infinite mana outlet what is it called y'all know talking what about some sort of staff 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 of completion uh no, i have not considered that just just i mean just throwing this out there granted this one does cost one mana but staff of completion does this very same thing but also can draw you cards i mean you do run t ogre but i recently put it in my reonia deck and it's actually pretty cool because you can uh motherfucking um get card advantage or ramp out to pay two life to make a man of any color or it just it lets you kind of do really funky things if you're not like on ad nods and you don't really care about your life total and especially for a low color deck so yeah, just throwing that out there if you ever thought about or just another copy, because that was my only question. Like, how do you remove your own thing when you're ready to win the game? And that kind of. Yeah. So that was my only question. Uh, and my other question I actually want to follow up with Sir then is you had drawn almost or at least 70 percent of your deck. Like same question towards you. Like, how does your deck win? And even more than that, how does uh like with all that card draw going off, did the what's it called thing stop you from winning the switcheroo thing? Yeah. Okay. Talk um, to I me. never uh, saw my my infinite ETB loop. Okay. Yeah. 
So I was really digging for it. I got you. Okay. And so for Star Trek, what what were you what yeah. what what line were you gonna go for? Hypothetically, yeah. Oh, I went for one. I got stopped. I was trying to go for the next one. I had I had Teamer Dockside ready oh. to go with Beast with Beast uh, Beast Whisper to draw and your then, deck. Even a mana draw my deck. And, uh, then, and then I could also once I hit something early, I could do Naya's intervention to stop not to kill myself out or anything, or hit all the things I need of abundance, keen sense, whatever. But okay. I, because I got stopped, I went for a different direction of trying to get uh, six. Because when I divining topped earlier, I found Imperial Recruiter. Got like, you. Great. So I was like, as long as I get to there, I cast six. I start using Quarian Ranger to get land from back to hand if I need it to go get Dockside and rebuild the, the loop. Right, right. I hear you. I hear you. That and then I sense. then I just win that way too. But also like Azusa with all the land draw could get me get me pretty close, and I was just trying to be valuable there. Mm-hmm. Uh, I had bird of life, tons of other things I could do. Yeah. I get if I didn't have to start discarding stuff. But yeah, I was I was basically trying to rebuild uh, Dockside or go for the six into um, six into yeah. what's it called? Uh, groundskeeper combo. Gotcha. Uh, to get infinite, infinite mana, which then would let me cast Nia's intervention for all of my lands, and everybody was below twenty five. That's pretty easy for me to just yeah. Do you just loop the lands from your graveyard. I'm guessing. That's one way to do, do it too. Uh, I was just going for the simple one of just draw, put them all in my hand, and just discard. Got you. Uh, that makes sense. Because I okay. had I had the mana outlet. Because I only need a mana outlet to make that one work. I don't need a draw outlet. Like that's the thing. Like, this deck is a balance of ways to spend mana or ways to spend ETB loops to draw or other things like that. So as long as I get ETB loops, uh, Beast Whisper gives me draw the deck. If I get infinite mana, there's a few different options to do it all. I can recur with Life Alone and. Um, Six, I can do recursion stuff with uh, what's the other one? Uh, Ashaya is in this deck with gotcha. uh, Korean Ranger and uh, Zercher Druid. That lets me just indefinitely kill you all with pings. Right, There's a lot right, of different right. options yeah. uh, to go for. I, I, I'm always worried in this deck that I'm going for. I have too many combo options. I hear uh, you. Yeah, I'm... but no I have resilience. I need enough to, to do to switch around. And six is solving so many of those problems. Like, oh, you killed everything. I get right. six out when you're done interacting, and I get it back for free because I have so much land in hand. No, a hundred percent. Like two things that came to my mind. One thing about my combo turn that actually would have been yeah. crazy based off your commander. But first thing is, um, mm-hmm. I I had the I in my head I was thinking I was fully transparent. I was thinking in my head, like Chad and Trek are stopping us, but they're like they're not winning the game. Not because they may not be trying to, but I was curious if y'all were able to win with the own with your own stacks piece on board but then realizing that you have to win and you have to see how you navigated the turn under the uh the, the fun chaos. enchantment yeah that fun en- <laughs> we're gonna call it the fun fun enchantment seeing yeah, yeah, how yeah. you navigated the fun fun <laughs> enchantment honestly made me that much more impressive with you because even because i was thinking like okay maybe he just drew half his deck and just can't win the game maybe it's a deck flaw it's not a deck flaw it was it was a crazy stacks piece that nobody ever decks text around but the, <laughs> you, the right, yeah. you navigated right. it very well though i have to give you your flowers and that you navigated it well okay. with your switch rules and then the same thing goes to chad being under oh, yeah. his own stacks effect once again navigating it very well realizing this like okay, getting rid of my stuff and i was no, really impressed by that like swappings killing it hey, getting man, drawn hey, like man. that's awesome exactly no like he, i mean but you he, he so did a proper threat with the ring you said what that's no, true if if you didn't have the ring this game would have gone it would have been a lot different. differently yeah, yeah. That, that, that was yeah. really valuable that's why i kept the hand i had enough mana to get it turn to turn two whatever it was so yeah. i was like yep we're doing ring no i think the the ring coming down was crazy the there were so many things that came down that were fucking crazy if i can also throw this down there was um on my on my winning turn i just realized funny it's just funny as fuck the so like oh so there was this interaction that i kept thinking about in my head so i played three fairy to bounce the thing but then i had to play the grand abolisher because chad bro could sack a land i mean could start discard a land to kill the teferi and then turn oh, yeah, on mark I'm glad you noticed that yes mm-hmm. yeah. you said what yeah i'm glad you noticed that because i was like i'm totally fine with this teferi i can just drop a land right just and waiting for me to like play course, the breach and then that's why of I, course, I was i think ahead. i was the only player that actually countered a spell besides your countering your own spell <laughs> I, I tell people I offers a fucking great counter spell it's a fucking yeah great. i 
I literally cast a pyroblast, and that was the only thing that was a hard counter this game. Yeah. No, I mean. Is that correct? I agree. I think yeah. so. Yes. And, but I check this out. Blast in mind, the, but I never drew it. The, the funny game. thing is, so, but check this. The very last thing is, if you didn't give me this soul ring, I would not have had the colorless mana to go Grand Abolisher <laughs> into into fucking underworld breach i would have had to go mm -hmm. underworld breach you would have killed my teferi and then marvin would have been able to abrupt decay, abrupt decay. my yeah. shit so literally that and soul ring switch is what, what uh helped me get across what the finish line it. <laughs> it's yeah. like i literally just did the math and i'm like oh shit chad chad was a, was the g there he was the bro he was the homie bro so like no I, I noticed that funny interaction because i would i had exactly enough mana to do everything like i had the the four lands plus the the soul ring plus the treasure allow me to perfectly like lock it down with the grand abolisher down as well so that was that was just well done man like on everybody's behalf I, i'm not skipping over marvin though our special guest i want to say first of all flowers to marvin and thank you bro because what time is it out there now four or five in the morning it's six o'clock in the morning it's, i want to <laughs> say before you give me your like i mean i want y'all to scroll back he had a crazy turn three thousand win or is it turn four uh, turn three, I guess. Turn, yeah, yeah. turn three. Thoughts yeah. went through a Ristic study on board. So yeah, like y'all, if y'all want to see the, uh, Tim the Thrasios do crazy things, and he was actually about to pull another win, uh, turn three. Thassa's whim if Chad had not dropped the Magus of the Moon. So let's just make that fucking clear. Oh. But uh, Marvin, from the beginning, ever since from the tutor all the way to the Magus Moon, like what was going through your head this game? Talk to me, Marvin. Bro, the, the first one was like pretty nice because I got like five cards and I had to, uh, even though I had a gemstone, I, and I, wait, let me get things straight. Yeah, I had a, I had a gemstone and the, the Autovara, right? So, yeah. and I'm like, and I had five cards in hand. I was like, hmm, Dasas and stuff. And like, and because I got the M seal, I'm like, yeah. oh, that's getting consultation. I'm like, yeah, got a good shit. I'm gonna do the <laughs> same thing, exact same thing again, right? And I'm like, yeah, okay, good shit. And then this Max, I'm like, hmm. <laughs> my, my draw for the first turn was also um uh a cr the chromox which i which i play casted right yeah. so i was like man this shit plays out smooth as hell and then there's the max and like hmm, okay everything is shit now just like get me get, get like somebody needs to win real, real quick I'm gonna, I'm gonna it, do nothing here bro this was the most perplexing game of magic i've played all week and yes, like in a good way, way in a good way in a it's very good way, way. I, 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 I loved it but I had for real. I'm, I'm, being, I'm gonna be honest here. I had the thing where someone is like talking for a lot, for like something interesting, and you are sitting there, and like your eyes are like slowly like closing, and like no, 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 stay focused, <laughs> because I'm doing nothing, right? I'm, I'm right. Just, like watching, yeah. and and for something I'm like okay, then I need to get a cup of coffee, right? Because I was <laughs> like, bro. <laughs> no, I kid you not. Like I was right there with you, Marvin. Like I, I, I probably wasn't being super entertaining on the stream because, like, if y'all look back, I was probably just, I was mean mugging the fuck out the screen. I was like, so he does that. <laughs> then I was like, literally just like, this is so fucking yeah. interesting because I was like, fucking interesting. Um, Gordy Party, yes, that was the last game. We, uh, Gordy Party earlier said no one CDH question mark exclamation point bless the question mark, and I said I think so because he fucking locked everybody out the game with two crazy powerful stacks pieces. Um, we definitely will eventually have to bring Chad on specifically to talk about his Noran list. And yeah, like if you also join the Thunder Conductor community, link in the bio, you can have no, uh, he can post his Noran list in the brewing corner and then you can see the list and everything before we do a deck tech, hopefully in the future. So yeah, but yeah, check it out, Gordy. That this will be the last game. But before I let y'all go, I just, um, Marvin, yeah, I was in the same position as you where I wasn't doing anything and I was just mean mugging the screen. Not cause I was angry, yeah. I was just like, I was like, Okay, then that happens. And I was so it was like it's like when you like watch it, like when LeBron is looking at a game, he's on the side, just like he's just like staring at the game. Like, are you angry? No, like this is just I love this. And it was just uh, yeah. when Chad Bro and Trek were going back and forth with the exchanges and like, oh, discard the land here. Okay, I'm just gonna play this again. Oh, I'm a deflecting swat. You hear? I'm gonna. It was like this. This is good. I like this. The whole time because yeah, 
as uh, I couldn't even talk shit, right? Because I right. was like, okay, okay, he's like this, and I was like, and then you, there was the wheel, and I'm like, okay, I got this orchid. No, you can't play the orchid because you will only have the ETB. There's no, Dude, you will have exactly. the exchange. I'm like, what the fuck? Am I, I'm like, what the fuck am I doing, guy? Like, what the fuck am I supposed to do here? And the only thing, and the only thing, like, which, like, after the wheel and the the, the con um, I do it for the Swiftly configuration. The funny thing is, I got an Adamus call, and like the, with uh, I was also praying like, don't take my thrusters because why would someone take my thrusters? But right. I don't know, right? Because with the thrusters on board, my plan was like, if I, if the stars align up and I'm like, like go in here, I can go for the world through it because in response to the like. Um, switch root thing, I could like tap uh, the, the word druid, right? And gotcha. also on, in, on to the second ETB for the switch configuration. Like, you will respond to both and triggers and draw yes. your deck. And oh, one, fucking one, one, crazy, yes, bro. And then I can, I, I, I just can, like, um, with um, how it's called, the, I always forgot the name, uh, the, the instant speed green tutor. Um, uh, Whirly tutor? No, the three costs one with X. Oh, oh um, Ar 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 Archmage's charm? Arduous uh, arm, arduous arm. Court of calling. Court of, Court of calling. Court of calling. Okay. Yeah, and I can. I have ways to play it two times with just green mana, so I could like Emil and or whatever. So that was my only possibility. Everything else was getting stopped here, <laughs> like pretty <Man>. fucked. <laughs> so, yeah. But no, I fucking love how you said literally you you could go up Diamond Skull, cast it with the switcheroo trigger on the stack, flashing that in with the switcheroo trigger of the flashing thing on the stack, generating infinite mana on top of that, and start just drawing and scrying through your yeah, deck sure. and just like either sculpting the perfect or there's a way you can win on instant speed, right? Yeah, yeah, so I can, uh, I have a plethora of ways to win and speak in this deck. Yeah. yeah, no, yeah, hundred percent. So, it, but I, so this was my only out. I'm, I was like, I was just praying, man. Oh, and, man. And, and, and I was just praying that the both like leading uh, non-blue players are just like, I thought, hmm, if they smash their heads in, uh, <laughs> maybe we, one of us can take the spot. <laughs> That's what yeah, I was yeah. thinking. My because only hope. I was, I was talking not, almost barely nothing, right? Because like I was like. Man, I have to focus so much, man. And then I was like getting like a little bit tired, and I'm like, oh fuck, man, stay calm, stay focused. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, and I, bro, check this out. That's how I felt. Like the so when I did the intuition. Oh, so my opening three that I kept, I kept land, land, intuition. That was literally <laughs> my Whoa, opening three. <laughs> I, I know, bro. I no, I, I'm not even fucking playing. I literally took land, land, <laughs> and then put fucking. Where is that intuition at, bro? Like, I, I kid you not, this was my opening three that I kept. And I was saying, you know what? If I draw two lands, at least I can go for an intuition combo. And yeah, it's yeah. going to be muddy. It's probably going to get countered, but we'll try that. But Magus and Moon came down. I said, I guess I'm not going for an intuition combo. <laughs> <laughs> and then I drew packed an offer and I was like, all right, well, I guess um, I'll just wait till someone, wait till the last time the cast out counter my own counter and make some treasures and then i drew a line tutor and so I, when i went for the intuition shit i was looking like i can go for a breach line but chad yeah. first of all chad kept up his exile all graveyards lane but it was still but it was a mountain but when skirt when boba uh, when track played his commander he could always kill the what's it called thing the magus of the moon to unlock the exile all yeah. graveyards land. Oh. So I all, I kept looking at the board, having to be quiet and focused because I was like, okay, that's Baxby's move. Okay, that that Saxby's came back and always kind of navigating like that navigating thing because it was like this was the opening three and it honestly got me there. Like it's true, a a, a great three is better than a, a what's it called, a, <laughs> than a, a mediocre seven. You know, even though Chad fucking tutored twice, that I would I, I would never got him, but because I would have to play my what's it called turn two, but still. Out, yeah. Can we still talk about that chat like screwed me over like twice? Because first you are you are like like the one who's like playing the Magos and then you had the audacity to count up my Phyrexian Metamorph. <laughs> and I was <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I felt I felt mixed about that. I thought it was the right move. You don't give four yeah, color deck. Fine. But it was like I was like fuck but at the same time like Trek is gonna win. Bro. I thought Trek was gonna win after that. And I was thinking in my head, like, I was thinking Marvin Kapalitsky said, bro, like, 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 literally just read, like, y'all know I have Thassa's, this is the cards in my hand. I have no counter magic to start tr to stop Trek. If he doesn't win next turn, it's gonna be time for that. He's the right, like, I would have started, like, politicking, like, bro, this is not what we counter. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, literally, bro. You know, granted, you yeah, couldn't say I was doing anything because I, I wasn't, I, I literally had nothing. But, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was like, that's what I was thinking. I'm like, 
I think you did the right thing, Chad, but it was tough. It was it was so tough because track was going to untap with a one ring on three or some shit at that or two or three at that point. And it was just clear that no one was going to be able to beat him if he kept drawing his library until you played that uh, chaos card, which was really spicy. But I, but I still get it, right? Because you don't want to like sit across like two rings. Exactly. Exactly. I, I, absolutely, I absolutely get it, right? Right. So I was, like, I was, it was I tough. Was it was tough. I, was, man. I mean, I was sad, but I, I absolutely understood. The, like, yeah. Yeah. No, but yeah. I'm like, bro, I got nothing. I do that for. <laughs> I, I, I merged and tutored. I, 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 I bent my consultation to, to be able to play the Femme Fury. Like, oh, it's my own. Please give it to me. And I'm like, nope. Nope. <laughs> um, question to Chad. In that, in that inter oh, my bad, Marty. Go ahead, bro. No, you're good. You're good. Oh, no. Uh, Mark, Chad, in that interaction with the Phyrexian Metamorphon stack, of course, I always tell people, do what you think is right, um, no matter what I politic, because I don't know what's in their hand. What was going through your head, head at that time, and what cards were, what what was going through your head, and what was in your hand to make you feel confident that uh, Pyro Blasting, uh, not py yeah, that Pyro Blasting, the One Ring, wouldn't completely give Trek the game in that situation? Or what was going through your head, bro? If the One Ring gets copied, the player with the Thassa's one. Decon is going to win. Yeah, He's going to win. I there's, agree. there's no way Trekkie can win out of the blue. Right. As fast as Marvin. Oh, great. Like, Plus, we know he had Thassa's Marvin would have drawn some damn but counter spells. I had, I had no, yeah, and I knew he didn't have any counter spells because obviously the board state was... Well, he, he was revealed so the wet. force, discarding the force off the will of misfortune. Which, which I'm guessing you didn't cast because you didn't want to pitch your Thassa's Oracle because that was your last out. If you ever drew Tainted Pact, you go Thassa's yeah. Tainted Pact and just win with the ETB, even though it's. Right, I mean, I, I got like I got alternative win count, right? Because I'm like I'm, I don't know. There's the casual player in me, but I got Thassa's also infinitely huge finale, um, Bowmaster, the uh, Emil Flicker. Yeah. And also run Prater's Grass because I don't like. I can't believe you like, didn't cast you know. that Bowmaster into the wheel. Yeah, but like, well, who but, would he give it to? Who yeah, he would have to? Yeah. Give, I didn't have a creature, had, so he would had, have to give it to either Chad or Trek. Yeah, I had one ETB, right? I could ping one thing, and then I had to like, oh, like, to, like, give it away because that was my 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 first reaction was like, "Damn boy, we in this bitch." This man did not say, "Damn boy, we in this bitch." I fuck with you so much, party, bro. I bro, fuck with you then, so much, and bro. Everything, and, and, and the second second after my my thoughts were in shambles again because i'm like nah bro i can't i can't i can't i can't i wish but i can't yeah <laughs> no like i i feel like the bow master would have been like a chaos on top of chaos bro like yeah. if you cast it that bow master you would have to say hey y'all Somebody gotta win this game. We gonna flip a coin on this bitch and see who gets the bone <laughs> or some bullshit. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, cause Absolutely. you can't objectively give it to Chad or Trek. You know what I'm saying? Cause no. Trek is gonna fucking wipe the board and start pinging people's life off. And maybe you could say don't ping me, but then he's gonna get a fucking uh, 21, 21 uh, bow master. Oh. And Chad would have fucking like it been this different thing, but he would have got a 14, 14. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And no one had removed. I didn't have removed for the bow master on board. In my hand, so it was like it. Yeah, that would have been crazy. Ah, uh, yeah. Damn, that card is crazy. Tell me the name of that card again, yeah. please. Confusion. Yeah, I right? have. To, like, I oh, yeah. have to slot in this this one in like some casual like, things. No. This like this looks like hella fun. Bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I kid you not. If you um audience, if y'all have never seen Confusion Ranks, this card is fucking I crazy. I put it in uh, the brewer's corner so you guys can read it. Yeah, yeah, it is three colors and two red um, enchantment. Whenever an artifact, creature, or enchantment enters the battlefield, its controller chooses yeah. target permanent. Another cre another player controls that shares a card type with it. Exchange control control of those permanents. It is a trigger, so you can respond to it. Like Martin was saying, like you can win through it. There are win cons that work, like Thassa's um, Decon and Thassa's Tainted Pact. But by far, like it shut off my breach line. It shut off so much like just juicy stuff because i was going to try to push for a breach before he had played that enchantment literally i was going to enlighten tutor my upkeep cast breach and then uh cast brain freeze fill the graveyard and go like that but then 
motherfucking like Chad put that card down. I'm like, well, I guess I'm not casting that shit. <laughs> like, yeah, the, the, the Teferi came clutch in for you, right? Because you could remove the confusion. Yes. Um, without, so I was gonna try to win. Confusion? I was gonna try to win the turn before, like the turn mm -hmm. when the confuse. So I knew as long as uh, I said I just need. He only had one man open, which was his uh, sack land to exile all graveyards and i knew he didn't have two to, to exile all graveyards so i said as long as he doesn't have two more mana borbrimus can't kill the magnus and he can't exile graveyards but then he chad like a fucking chad fucking played the confucius thing which caused it just said fuck my entire turn because i was originally gonna because the magnus was still on board i was gonna go motherfucking uh treasure and lion tutor cast the um get the underworld breach and then pay two for the underworld breach go get led out the graveyard and then go and just do exactly what i did but i couldn't do it because he played that cook the uh the uh the chaos card and then the turn after that the wheel i drew the teferi and i was like does this work? And then I, I found that it, it did work. So the Teferi was clutch off the wheel. Very clutch. So yeah. Fuck, man. Fucking crazy. It's dude. just a it's just a red perplexing Kaiman. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here, bro. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with it, man. It's the, I don't think it's a bad card. I think I enjoyed this game. Uh, oh, gr gr uh, Gordy Porty says, sounds, um, sounds like I missed a good game. No, Gordy, it was a fucking amazing game. Yeah. It was a great it was. game and it I, I like I don't like saying meta fringe and all this other stuff because it's like everything is subjective. But it was literally the epitome of the good decks, quote unquote, were just sitting there doing nothing because Chad <laughs> and Trek literally their decks were just <laughs> built to just cuck the meta, and they just said, "Okay, oh you want to play good cards? Oh that's cute. Okay, okay," and just you guys look. ain't doing yeah. shit right in, in, at my place. <laughs> you said what? You can, sit in the, you can sit down in this corner right there and stay there. <laughs> you as fuck. Bro, yeah, so like I was just sitting there with a, I had a finger at uh, Marvin's commander. I was like, or the card, the, the thing that he played. I was like, I was just like, if he tries to do anything, I have multiple lands to go. Cool. In reaction yeah. to that, I kill it. In reaction yeah. to that, right. I still kill it. Like, I was like yeah, I'm not yeah, worried about that, him winning. No. Exactly. That's why I was, I was, I was almost counting lands because I was like, after at, at the um, <laughs> when, when when T won, right? I was yeah. like, hmm, you almost got no lands in hand, so ma I might be able because I was thinking a lot, right? Because well, as I said, had, uh, 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 Chad, I controlled Orb at that point, so I could not stop either one of you no matter what I yeah. tried. Right. Yeah, so he, he, took my, he took my tool out of my hand. <laughs> no, but I was thinking Chad just grew a good. You have a land in your hand. You had a, a land in your hand, right, Chad? Them. Um, at what point? At the when I uh, went for the it, breach it, line, did you have a land oh, in yeah. your hand? You there, Chad? Oh yeah, I had two. I had yes. two. Oh, and boy. so my thought Look, process. All my, all my thinking was, was, was for nothing. Good no, like know. literally, my whole thought process was. Oh, you're talking about he? You he would have stopped your what's it called combo? Yeah. You, oh yeah. yeah. I was I was counting yeah. lands, right? Because but yeah. I, I, I slipped that. Which, right? But I was like, okay, he got a lot of lands. Maybe he will like using using them on other stuff, and I can like slip through. Right. But yep. now with this information revealed, bro, I would like. I'm. It doesn't even matter. No, nah, yeah. That Borbogrismos uh, commander is really good. It's a lot better than I yeah. thought. Yes, like I think in in I yeah. think the addition of stacks in your deck track was exactly what it needed. And I think so too. It was and going more landfall. I think going more landfall was definitely a big thing because otherwise I was just sitting there going. Kind of like a tally. I'm just like turbo all in on something. And if it doesn't work, I just sit around and watch I mean, the game go by. And if so honestly, I, I do appreciate this style. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah no, I, I love that style because I'm gonna be honest. That oof, if that oof would have came down. Oh yeah, it's I was zero percent hope because literally all I had my whole dream was the enlightened tutor in my hand. I said like, yo, give me this <laughs> this source to plowshare. Fuck this oof. I don't need I don't need my color man. I got a talisman, bro. Get, yeah, yeah. Breach is red. Fucking give me this source to plowshare so I can cut this shit, please. I don't want this oof because I didn't want that anywhere near the board state because I wouldn't I wouldn't have been able to do anything else. I would have been locked out. I wouldn't be able to cast enlightened tutor in my hand or anything. And I'd have to yeah. wait for you to say, oh, I'm done with my oof. I'm I'm okay with that. You know what I'm saying? I was, I was thinking about it too because I, I started to get into really close to Dockside. Right. I, like, I almost have all the pieces. I just need to get close enough. And I was like, if I, if I top decked uh, if I top decked something, I'm like, okay, great. I'm drawing six cards and I'm going to go. Like, yeah. One of those moments too. I was just waiting for the see enough of the pieces, get a tutor in hand. Like I had Court of Calling one point early. I'm like, I can Fuck. get it. I can go get it. But then, uh, <laughs> then people started deleting things. I started using other things to defend myself and 
keep things around and do a chat a little bit. Like, oh man, I have to do this to stick around. So it was fun. Golly, you know, man. I love Warped. This no, is the deck I'm... that I'm going to always be reshuffling and using new cards yeah. and changing stuff out. I will always be fighting to make this the no. highest power that it can. If that's always just a nine, that's fine with me. <laughs> But eight, shit, I mean, too, look, but, look, and this this game was just honestly like at that point, I probably would maybe think of you saw the impact the tape that Blood Moon had on the table. Granted, how often do you play against a model red deck? But I don't, yeah. I'm not an advocate for Blood Moon. I, I went, think I, when I, people I play for, Dark Side, Mage, Mage of the Moon is the only I was, I was already on the board of, right? I wasn't, I'm not feeling so much of the uh, the Valakut to be honest, so yeah, and no, like the Valakut, I think you can live without to be honest, like that one's a yeah, little. Exactly. It's it's, I was it's fun with it. yeah yeah I think that one that one's on the cute line but the ma yeah, switching yeah. that one out for the mages or maybe another value engine yeah. would have been good but it looks like we're losing everybody but hey Martin uh, Martin Chad and Trek I appreciate and honor you all so much thank you all for coming on to the gameplay section thank of the stream you, it was the best. Bruh, I and I like y'all. I just big thank thank you to everybody, but think big thanks to Marvin waking up at two in the morning to play with this. Like he's in Germany, correct? And just you are fucking yes, awesome, dude. Thank you so much. Really, like I just really wanted you on the channel because like you're just funny as fuck, bro, and like your energy's hilarious. I just fucking like I fuck with you a lot, man. So thank he's you a good. lot, bro. Turn three, but he can, man. <laughs> we give you the VIP treatment. We give you the free win. Even though, okay, guys, then now you need to stop because I'm just like two tones lighter than like T, and I'm blushing. Okay, so like, can we like? <laughs> but I can, I can say the same, same at you guys. Uh, He's so. so humble. Look at me. <laughs> oh, <bro>. No, no. <laughs> yeah. well, yeah. uh, again, next time, next time, um, I'm. Uh, I'm down if, if I'm getting invited again. So. No, hundred percent, bro. You will be back at the channel, okay? But I'll, I'll make sure we'll schedule stuff out so I give you more leeway. I know lad, this time I <laughs> I probably hit you up. What was yeah. it? Three, four days before, and like I, I'm glad I caught you on holiday. But we'll schedule something yeah. so we bring you back on the channel soon, okay? And I want to know the yeah, magic yeah. behind the turn the can, the uh, the uh, the hundred percent turn three thousand because you, bro. I pro last thing Marvin not, is yeah. classic for just out of nowhere. Just thousands win. I'm like. How do you keep getting thasis, bro? What the fuck are well, you doing? I mean, it's classic, right? And I, and, and a lot of times I'm just mulli mulligan, like I just Dude. like mulligan down to so five good. or four sometimes. Yeah. And I mean, the, my like my deck is like, in, uh, like if you compare it to other TNTs, it's like um, full to the brim yeah. with like wind comes because I run <gasps> devoted druid combo, Kinnebus side. The Bloom Tender and uh, Elder World, how it's called, the Fabro Elder plus, um, plus the Enchantment, uh, Free from the Real, and the um, the other one, uh, Chain yeah. Stasis. So these are Instant Speed, Infinite Mana wins, um, and, and then the classic Tassas and shit, so yeah. it's like, yeah, it's not too, too common. And I also like run Aladam, we call all those like future tutors. Got so, you, and so that... So it's like, it's very easy to, and just, I mean, Tassas is like basic, it's like right. efficient, right? We all know that, but right. uh, this deck is also very good at just like future pre pre tutoring and like, yeah, yeah. So, and I, up, we run black, so. yeah i definitely agree with that i feel like that like if you can take a hand with two tutors any day because literally just like imperial seal for the for the instant side of the thoughts yeah. combo and then creature tutors are like all day every in, day within a, a green list so yeah i definitely hear that okay yeah. well in the first game i i had my, my hand was like um i don't know exactly but it was little pedals lands two or three i'm not sure and um, then the consultation plus the the court of calling right and i'm like oh right hmm, sweet sweet seven okay i guess i'll stick with it was it yes. seven it was seven i guess so and i'm like mm, okay neat because like with thrusters can provoke also for green i had at least two green sources from lands if i uh, remember correct I, I think so. And uh, those, everything of like all those things are like easy, right? And even in the, in the game where I had the, I, I it didn't even like use the card of cunning because I had also an Aladamri's call or something, uh, something else. Right. So it was like, yeah, it's, in this deck, it's very easy to assemble. It's, right. it's very, very. Easy. No, because like literally, like every game we played, I think a day or two ago as well, was like back to back. Like yes, sir. every time, like yes, sir. I think first game you won Thassus. But yeah, yeah, and the second dude like angels crashed me. Yeah, and it was the second game. I was I was ready for that time. I was like, you're not getting me again. <laughs> and then when we played the first game earlier today, I was looking like, if you fucking thoughts us again, bro, 
I like I love Thassa's as a win kind. It's clean, simple, gets the job done. I'm, I'm not. I don't have like the faster somebody wins, the faster we can play another game. As long as you don't skip out on this, you let's play another game. I'm good. Yeah. But Martin, I just like bro. That Thassa's is glued to his hand because I'm looking like this motherfucking fucking Thassa's us again, bro. <laughs> I was like, if you fucking Thassa's us again, I was just like, fuck. But man, I, man, I just want to say I honor and respect you all. Thank you all so much for coming on the stream one more time. Thank you all. Stay safe. Stay safe. Yes, sir. Y'all be amazing, okay? Yeah, brother. All right. Bye -bye. Peace out. All righty. All righty. All righty. Thank you Later, all. Later, skater. All right. Thank you all so much for being part of this stream. I honestly, like, I had a blast. Like, if there is anything that I've said in the past, is you, 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 like, I, that's why I love long games because you never know what the fuck can happen. I'm really glad that Satya was able to get there this game. I'm not gonna fucking lie. I had hope the entire game because I'm like, I can always pivot my mindset to try this and try this. But this game was like an endurance trap of like, I just need to try something and I, I just can't give up. No matter how much they stacks me, I, have to, I can't give up. So I'm so fucking happy that I was able to get there. But also just to be able to see the fun interactions, the fun cards, and just to really do all the crazy things that come with playing CDH. If you have never played CDH, make sure to check out this format. But with that being said, if you're looking for some more ways to support the channel, we have a plethora. Starting off with our Thunder Conductor proxies. We have all of these beautiful things. Check the link out in the bio, both card stack and pay, uh, premium paperback. My way to increase access to the amazing format that we call CEDH. Not to mention, if you have some Modern Horizon 3 cards that you want, we are, I can show you right here. We have great A card stock card stock right there i got i made myself this deck and of course got the stamp of approval the thunder conductor stamp of approval to make sure that you get the card that you desire before they come out and you can test them out for a great price we also have a thunder conductor merch my way to increase to the, to all the comfort and whatever not i really love this it's soft clean that's what you got to do if you also want to join the Discord community so you can play games with me and get in the Brewer's Corner, the Borborigmo deck is a deck that he actually talked about, the Brewer's Corner, and we went back and forth to really find what was best for the deck. So if you want to join that the amazing community of Happy Brewers, check out the Discord. But if you want more exclusive access to get yourself shoutouts on the stream, have chances to have your deck featured right here on the stream, and also get exclusive Q&As, don't worry. Check out the Patreon and our Mono Red tier. I want to take a second and shout out our Mono Red Patreons, Scott Mitchell, Wavy Hashira, Nathan Stridum, The Praetor, and Sir Trek. Y'all are awesome and you keep the lights on the way that you could not imagine. And last but not least, if none of that tickles your fancy, you just want to say, AT, I don't want the Patreon. I don't want the, the merch. I don't want the proxies. I just want to say fun one time for the fun time that I love what you do and I support you and I want to bless you. Don't worry. Check the link out in the bio. Buy me a coffee. It keeps me up. It keeps the lights on. But with that being said, y'all be amazing and I'll see y'all later. Peace.